All right, so look, this is gonna be a really cursed one. This is not, this isn't, the fog, the fog mod really does, hang on, it's gonna get loud for a sec. No, it's gonna stay the same. The fog mod, you see, makes it so whenever I go through any fog gate in the game, including like one of the ones that just like separates multiplayer zones, which I don't know where any of those are. I didn't play this game online once. Um, I get teleported somewhere else randomly connected to another fog gate. Now these are making a logical map. It's just, I don't know where anything goes until I've gone in. Now I've decided to escalate. Um, cause there's also another mod setting in the fog gate randomizer that makes it so the mod never links to open world zones. It'll only connect into the interconnecting web of smaller zones until you've beaten a boss which gives you access to a larger open world area. And then I'm going to tick every setting that enables all of the caves and tunnels and various completely unremarkable hulls in this fucking game and long dark or long drive this uh this randomizer i'm going to make this a long drive like i'm turning this into a strand type game I've, i'm turning it into a strand type video game the only thing we'll be allowed to randomize once we've started so as to not soft lock ourselves is enemies so if i get fucking owned enough times we will re-randomize the enemies in the seat however once the fog is made and once the enem once the items are placed those are locked in for good we're also using uh as a baseline mod for like some like just rebalancing and stuff elden ring uh reforged it's like built into the mod pack i'm using for a lot of this so there will be some gameplay changes i was gonna do i was gonna try to do this with convergence but that's still an alpha and there's just there's just no way there's just no way is it like warcraft 3 reforged golly i sure hope not Golly. Isn't reforged way harder? Did you know that no difficulty matters when everything's random? Also, simultaneously, I think you're thinking of Ascended. Uh, there's like a mod called like Elden Ring Ascended. That's the really hard one. There's like a bunch that all have the same kind of naming conventions. And you're thinking of Ascended. Speaking of Blizzard, they canceled PvE for Overwatch. Is that misinformation being spread? <laughs> I haven't heard that yet, and I know enough Overwatch friends that I feel like I would have heard about it by now. That's true? Yeah, but like, I never cared. <laughs> we all knew this was. Did anyone here, was anyone here like hyped for the PvE? Ever? Come on, you could have been hyped like two years ago, but after seeing how it's been going, at a certain point, you gotta look around and be like, wait a minute. This is nothing. There's nothing here, you know? When will they add hunger to Overwatch? More competitive shooters need to have survival mechanics. That is something I agree should be more relevant. Add survival mechanics to these fucking games. There should be a piss meter in Apex. No, I mean, like, here's the thing. We don't need piss meters. Okay? That's not gonna... That's not going to change the gameplay of a survival battle royale unless there's smell-o-vision, and if someone pisses in the wrong spot, you can hunt them down like a hunting dog and kill them. 
until that's in there, God forbid we ever reach that timeline where there's smell of vision and battle royales and people are pissing themselves because they haven't pissed in so long in the video game, and then fucking you, just, you can just hunt them down from their smell alone. I don't think we need that. Although, imagine the fucking, imagine the goddamn announcers at an esports game, and they're like, Oh! Gamer guy 29 is hunting him down! It, it, it looks like John Gamer pissed his pants in game! And Gamer guy 29 is fucking going right after him! He found him! Like, imagine that. Think about it. Think about that being like the fucking big moment of a tournament is someone didn't manage their piss mechanic correctly and then they got actually owned. Anyways, we're never talking about this ever again. I would thank you to uh, accept that and respect it. Thanks. Oh. Apple's new VR headset in three weeks. Yeah, I just don't care about it. Dude, I mean, like, here, what, what's the Apple's VR headset gonna do for me? <laughs> you know, what's it gonna... What's it gonna do for me, though? Like, is it gonna... What's it gonna do? Charge me a lot of money? Be more expensive than an index? Probably. Because you're paying for the name. Honestly, until VR is lightweight, fully wireless, and here's the one that wigs me out. Has built-in full body tracking. I don't care. All right. Well, the only way they get built-in full body tracking from something strapped to your head, all right, is if you're entering, like, some fucking, like, Sword Art Online shit, my guy. I don't think you want that. I don't think... <laughs> I don't think you want to get fucking... isekai through some kind of apparatus strapped to your brain. I kinda do that. Well, that's the thing those fucking animes never show you is the part where the game has a bug. The part where the game has a bug or it had to go down for maintenance for five minutes. Or, like, all the inconveniences of, like, a video game, you know? Like, they, they don't show you those parts in the anime. They cut around the part where, like, the like an enemy just wouldn't spawn for 40 minutes. And it was a required drop for a quest. They cut around that. Life is already full of bugs, same thing. Yeah, but like, in a fucking, in, in, in life, when a bug comes at you, you can be like, oh, and kill it. In a video game, typically if a bug comes at you, it's greeted, it greets you with like a fucking crashed desktop. It kills you. Most of the time, it kills you. It's very rare that you say, hey, I found a catastrophic bug in the video game and I fixed it for you, devs. And I fixed it for you. I just looked it up and the Apple VR is expected to be 2K. Dude, Apple needs to come back to Earth. <laughs> they need to come back to Earth. What did you just say? $2,000? $2,000? Dude, you better be releasing, like, you better have, like, 40 of the best VR games ever made as exclusives on that fucking system. You're gonna launch that shit. That better blow my mind. Good thing I don't like Apple. It's a good thing I don't use Apple products. See, I use a 
I use whatever is it. I, I, it's not even because I really hate them. It's because I just don't like how upcharged all their shit is. It just makes me upset. For that price, I better be put in the video game. Yeah, I mean, if you're gonna charge me 2K, double an index setup. You, I better close my eyes and wake up in Skyrim, motherfucker. I better feel the Skyrim air, the wind blowing down from the fucking mountains. Okay, if you're gonna tell me I need to pay 2K for this VR setup. I better get Isekai. <laughs> Yeah, I don't think hey, I gotta like look this fucking thing up, don't I? I have to like actually look up Apple VR headset. What the fuck does this thing look like? The Apple hang on, this is this is from Tom's guide. I don't know who Tom is, but they they have a website that looks relatively informed. Uh VR slash AR headset, everything we know so far. I had to scroll down pretty far to see the parts they know. It could cost $3,000 thanks to a load of high-end mixed reality tech. So everything I'm seeing here is like this is a wireless like goggle setup. Like, from the images, I don't know if those are the real deal images. They're looking like a wireless goggle setup. And, um... I don't... I don't know if... I don't really think Apple is making a very smart decision. I would argue that this industry of VR does not need... Look, okay, here's the thing. Yes, VR headsets are fucking uncomfortable. But... At the end of the day, the other thing that's keeping people from buying VR is that there's not really that much on the market that's enticing to people, I don't think. It's not a very enticing market to get into for games or like anything like that. So it's like, there can't just, the, the steamroll can't just, like we can't just keep bum rushing towards the tech part when like the price part and like the games and stuff on the market that people would want to use are like lack, you know, it's like there is a, there's like three different things that all need to progress at the same time and improve for VR to succeed. And like for Apple to just be like, we're all in on the tech part and uh, we're making it $7,000 is basically the dumbest thing I've ever heard of. <laughs> Classic Apple. Did you see that? Yeah, I've already seen the Overwatch 2 thing. Typically, with it, if, if the VOD says I've been going for 15 minutes, someone beat you to it. Unless, like, it came, like, the news dropped during those 15 minutes. Someone beat you to it. Yeah, I mean, you can tell pretty clearly that right now Blizzard has one thing on the fucking docket, uh, and it is making sure that Diablo 4 pro hopefully releases in a functional and good state because their PR team fucking needs that one real bad. They really gotta dunk that one. If Diablo 4 doesn't dunk hard, they are fucked. It is, that is, they are in a big load of trouble if that fucking game doesn't fucking absolutely dunk. They need it to dunk. Because everything else... Like, here's the thing. Doesn't matter if, like, that Dragonflight or whatever expansion WoW had was, like, well accepted and stuff. The, the fact of the matter is people are stopping to care. People have stopped caring as much about WoW. It's... It's... 
It's been long. It's been a long time. WoW doesn't... WoW is not a, like, fucking... It's not a... It doesn't matter to, like, the public at large anymore. It doesn't matter. They really needed Overwatch 2 to fucking pop off, and it didn't. So now they really need Diablo 4 to pop off because they're running out of things. <laughs> they, they, they're running out of things now. They have... What are they gonna do? StarCraft 3? I don't think... I don't think Blizzard would ever make a new IP ever again. <laughs> I, I just don't think they'll ever do it. I think that... I think that there is a level of like recognition between all their IPs that to make a new one is to enter the danger zone of what if this one isn't rec like recognized as well as all of our other cool things we made uh, like a decade ago or two decades ago. Warcraft 3 re-reforged. It's a bad, that was a bad scene. It's definitely w wild that like everyone was so excited for it. And then I saw my friends playing like the fucking like Warcraft three customs and no one's using the reforged stuff. It's just like, they're just playing old Warcraft three still. They just have to pay for it now and shit like that. It's like, they just have to pay the premium for the reforged version for some, it's such a fucking weird situation that whole thing. World of Starcraft. I, you know, the reason I think they'll never do a Star, like a bigger Starcraft thing. I don't think there's as much of a market for sci-fi as there is for fantasy in gaming. I don't think I don't think Blizzard is enticed enough to do a, uh, to do a sci-fi thing. I think there's more market for fantasy, and there always has been. You know. But StarCraft is fantasy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is. Space opera. We're just throwing around words, dude. We're just throwing words around. Look. It may be Diablo 4 will be epic, chat. <laughs> Maybe Diablo 4 will be epic. <laughs> nurse! Nurse! Another canister from the deepest, purest vaults! Like Immortal was, Nodders. Dude, I'm glad I didn't play that one. I, I mean, I wouldn't have anyways. I fucking hate mobile games. I, I, I can't play like action-y mobile games with my fucking thumbs in the way the whole time, all right? I can't do that. But also simultaneously, I don't like being sold things while I play a game. Godfall stream when? Isn't that game already fully offline? <clears throat> Isn't that like one of those like games as a service games that like got shot like the day after it walked out on like like to, for release like the next day like Ubisoft whoever made it was like and you're done get back inside you failed and they bring them into a back room and just take them out I think you're thinking of Babylon's Fall. These are all the same. You're saying the same name. You're saying the same name. Babylon's Fall. Godfall. Babylon whatever the fuck. It doesn't matter. Buy a nickel for every single games as a service game made by some two-bit fucking publisher pulling together a poor team of developers to fucking shovel out some garbage to try to chase this trend. Dude, I would be at, I'd be filthy rich. Redfall. 
fall guys. <laughs> How many fall games are there gonna be this fucking decade? How many people can fall before we start standing? Think about it. Death standing suit. <laughs> True. Fallen order. Dude, I'll tell you what, well, I'll, I'll tell you what fucking dev naming conventions really like for games right now is basically just the word fall. The idea of descent. Greed fall. <laughs> There's just a lot of them. There's a lot of them. They really like that word. Titanfall. Leave that fucking game out of it. Alright? The only... Those titans weren't falling. Alright? They were fucking careening down to land on someone. That wasn't a fall. That was a dive. That was a dive. Titanfall gets a pass. Leave them alone. They haven't they suffered enough. <laughs> Didn't they suffer enough? You mean Apex? <laughs> yeah, I guess I did. Dude, if I ever played Titanfall, people would just be like, Why are you playing Apex, dude? Why are you playing that old version of Apex? Get back. Get out there so I can kick your ass in the Battle Royale, idiot. Get out there. I need you online so I can kick your ass, so I can snipe you and kick your ass. Get on the real game. Titanfall died for Battle Royale. I can't think about what's... It's hard to think about what's worse. That Titanfall would have died for a battle royale or died for a games-as-a-service looter shooter. Huh. I think... I'd take battle royale over that one. Because looter shooter, that like, games-as-a-service games basically are where creativity goes to die, I think, entirely. Uh... Because everything has to be turned into some kind of nickel and diming attempt. Whereas with a battle royale game, the odds still have to be fair for everyone participating, or no one will play it. And thus nothing can be sold that gives anyone a wildly unfair advantage. So I think I'd still take a battle royale game. Suicide Squad devs having to remake the entire game. Because everyone hated what they should. Dude. <sighs> Who's the publisher of that game? Because it's their fault. You know for a fact. It's not like the devs were all like, Nah, guys. The direction we want to take this is games as a service. This makes sense. Was it Warner Brothers or was it Rocksteady? Warner Brothers. That <laughs> sounds. If it's Warner Brothers, then that adds up. Uh, they've made awful decisions for their fucking game releases before. If it's Rock Rocksteady's the developers, well, here's the last thing that here's the last really bad one I remember that Warner Brothers did was uh fucking what? Hang on, I gotta double check this before I say it. Yeah, Warner Brothers did Shadows of War or Shadow of War, and that game had some fucking absolutely heinous fucking microtransaction bullshit in it at launch. And they had to, and I would have thought Warner Brothers learned their lesson with that one because like a fucking like month or two later, they edited out all of their fucking microtransactions. They patched them out because it was actually fucking awful. Like they literally patched them out of the game.
Damn. I, but, like, here's the thing, though. Money is epic. I think we all know and agree. Money is epic. So, like, how can you blame them? Let's all get send some support to our local mom and pop massive multi-billion dollar publisher conglomerates. Okay, because they do. Like, they always need a little more, though. It's not about the money. We're all in this together. Okay? We're all in this together. Let's start a GoFundMe. Dude, which pu gigantic publisher do you think is going to be the first one to actually unironically make a GoFundMe to, like, cover the fucking bills of some, like, game fumble? Because at some point, someone is going to be like, maybe we can, like, get some, like, a little bit extra money off of this, like, for this massive fumble. EA? Yeah, EA's only got their fucking FIFA. Wait, did EA lose FIFA? EA lost FIFA, right? And they also lost Star Wars, right? Wait, what does EA do now? Do they make pachinko machines now? Cause that's I know another developer publisher that got into that. Do they maybe they do that now? Madden. I mean, if I was Madden and I saw FIFA back out of that one, and then I saw Disney's Star Wars back out of that one, I'd start looking around. <laughs> I'd start, start looking around and uh, wondering if maybe I should get out of there too before it's too late for me, you know? I still weep for Silent Hills, but, but, but you can play Silent Hills. You can play it anytime you want in your local pachinko parlor by hitting the lever. I don't understand why none of you know that this game is out there. It is out there. You just have to hit the lever. What's wrong? Don't you guys have money to hit the lever? Like, if you didn't have cell phones to play the Blizzard game, you definitely have some money sitting around so you can hit the lever. Don't say you don't. But my rent. Yeah, but don't you want to play Silent Hills? Konami put all their fucking development time into those machines with the levers. You have to, you have to hit it. You gotta hit it once, just one hit. Just one hit. Done, Scarpin' it. Thanks for the five gifted subs, thank you. Thank you. 99% of pachinko players quit right before they make it big. We don't, I, dude, I've never been to a casino in the US or anywhere. I, is pachinko even a thing? Like, commonly in, like, the U.S., like, casino scene. I don't... Is it? Like, I, I feel like it's not something you see around here. It's big in Japan. Damn, man. So all you gotta do is you gotta buy a fucking ticket on a flight to Japan, go to the nearest Japanese pachinko parlor, and then hit the lever. It's not hard. Get yourself on a plane and hit that fucking lever. You can't even legally win money from Pachinko in Japan. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, so they really are just hitting the lever to hit the lever. Damn, man. Honestly. Honestly, can you blame Konami for making pachinko machines if they don't even have to give money out if, like, they win the pachinko game? Like, the person playing the game. Dude, that's like that's like printing money. That's free. I, dude. 
literally, people just put money into it, and then no money comes out when they get a jackpot. They, they get to keep all of it. They're just hitting the lever. They fucking did it. You win toys and sell the toys to the shop for cash. So it's one of those, it's one of those things where you just, there's just one more step because they can't legally dispense money, but they can dispense things like the equivalent of like tickets at an arcade, but those tickets are money. It's kind of basically like chips at a gamb at like a casino. It's like chips at a casino and where you're just getting chips deposited instead. Dude, if I was the fucking person who passed the law where no more money was allowed to be fucking <laughs> dispensed at casinos thinking I was some hero of the people, and then immediately they just loopholed me with the most basic, obvious loophole ever, dude, I'd quit. I'd quit that I got owned that hard. That I literally instantly got owned with, like, a fuck- like, something a four-year-old would think of. Like, a four-year-old would think of that. <laughs> Damn. That's, that's awful. That's the saddest thing I ever heard. That's fucked. <laughs> no, officer. These are funny bucks. These aren't... These aren't dollars. Now, funny buck does convert perfectly to American USD in a one-to-one. -one. But, we don't do that here. It's not really money. I can't buy anything with funny bucks, you see. Other than money. Other than American USD. loot boxes and keep dude we played me and like uh, the gang played fucking csgo for like a night like two weeks ago because we were just like bored and wanted to find something to do and we were like doing like in-house csgo just like hanging out it's like a fun time until like there was a moment like a lull of silence why because you can have fun and play games with your friends without needing to make a big deal about it, chat is why uh, that's not the point of this. The point was, though, at the, uh, there was a lull in the gameplay for a second. There was a moment where we weren't playing the game. And that's about all it took for, like, three people in the group to be like, I'm getting into opening CSGO boxes right now. Because I want this skin. And, like, everyone else was like, you need to, like, consider perhaps buying the skin you want if you're that desperate. We are never going to play this game again. You know this, right? Like, I'm telling this to them. I'm not going to out them because they might be embarrassed if I outed them. But everyone was like, you can just buy it the skin and it'll be cheaper than buying all the boxes and the keys and rolling over and over again. And they just... For the next 10 minutes while, like, Sput was trying to set up a new lobby for us to play in. They were just on a live stream in the Discord channel. Rolling the fucking dice hitting the lever the whole time. Like, pouring money into CSGO. And they were like, this is fun. And I'm, out, I'm over here like, holy shit. They got him. They got him in one. They got him. It took one second for Gamble Brain to activate. <laughs> it took one second for Gamble Brain to activate, dude. <laughs> it was wild. Did they win though? Of course they didn't fucking win. 
A bunch of fucking, like, nasty skins that look like someone, like, smeared shit all over them. For ten minutes. But, you know, at the end of the day, uh... You know, 99% of CSGO box openers uh, quit before they make it big, and I think if we had had another couple minutes, they might have gotten that big one. But instead, they just poured a bunch of money into a drain, never got anything out of it. A shame. Couldn't be me. Couldn't be me, LOL. Couldn't be me. Pathetic. That sounds like Sam. Dude, Sam is like the bit. I, I don't want to fucking. I don't want to point. But I, I gotta say, I have to say, Sam is the biggest whale I know. I think, at least last I checked, he, he, he plays the gotchas. He whales hard, and I think he thrives in it. I think he thrives. In I don't know many f other friends that like play gotchas. I know, I know, I think, I think like Juniper plays like a ton of fucking Genshin or whatever. That I've heard them mention it. So they're probably destitute from the fucking wailing if they wail. They're probably doomed. But like, yeah. He literally said yesterday he spent about 2k on freestyle basketball too. That Sam said that. <laughs> he, he said that. Wild. That's wild. I mean, he made a lot of money off of that subathon, though. He good. He's good. I watched my ex spend 4k on Genshin for one character. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. That's literally impossible. Yeah, but like, how would you know unless... You, but like... Are you sure it's literally impossible? Or is there a way that you can do it all really bad and somehow need 4K to fix your problem or something? Hit <laughs> the lever 90% quit before they make it big. Listen, all right, chat, if I'm gonna gamble, I'm gonna gamble in something that's gonna give me some money back. I ain't gonna gamble into something that's like, cool, you get a shiny thing. Wow, I can't take those funny bucks around to my local Yakuza around the corner and convert it into USD. I can't do that with a fucking Genshin character. I can't. I don't think. Maybe I can. Have you tried? I don't know. I don't know. Dude, that's the thing is that I don't go on, I don't go on gotchas. Cause I, I mean, I, I've never made it. It's never been subtle that I, uh, I know I would wail. I know I'm the kind of person that would wail in a fucking game. And the way I protect myself is by never playing. Uh, I have the willpower to not ever turn it on. But I would wail if I could. I don't think I'd get addicted. Like, I think if I was in, like, a casino in real life, like, when I go to Vegas, we'll probably, like, gamble for a night. 
But like, that's the thing is I'm going to be with friends and I trust my friends to be like, all right, we're done. If I, if it ever got to a bad point, but like at the end of the day, that's not something I would do on my own. <laughs> I would go to a fucking casino on my own without like a friend I trust to be like, all right, that was the limit you said. We're getting you out. You know? I just don't do those kinds of things. <laughs> we got you, bro. No, no, no. No, just one more. Let me hit the lever one more time. Just one more. Darkest Dungeon 2 with light gotcha. Yeah, but like they don't charge you candles. They don't like charge you money for candles, you know? That game, you get them for winning and playing. Gotcha mechanics that don't have any pay, like microtransaction to access them is just random generated loot until they do. But they're not. Look, chat, this is a, that's a nothing argument why well, I, I think gotcha can exist in a game without like like that kind of random gen stuff isn't like problematic on its own unless they add a microtransaction for it it's just at that point it's just random drops darkest dungeon 2 gotcha is not pay to win well, here's the thing. I know I, I, it's not pay to win in the sense that I'm paying money to win, but it is pay to win in the sense that if I go into a level with 80 candles and buy like 30 fucking like gold trinkets right at the start of the game, four fucking in items, like five cart items, and then walk in there with a ton of battle items all at the same time on my next run, my odds of winning that run of Darkest Dungeon 2 are objectively higher. <laughs> like, let's let's be real. I, I honestly don't think that Darkest Dungeon 2 should be giving us the items we unlock when we finish a, like a round. Because you do just come out way stronger. Sometimes I just have one off of the back of the loot I got from the last wipe. What happens when you run out of items to unlock though? Well, here's the thing. Uh, if you pump your cart in Darkest Dungeon 2, uh, you can literally enter the first in with like a hundred fucking relics or some stupid shit. Like, you can go in with enough to buy what you need that you would have gotten from the fucking candles, like, every time. So it's like, the, you don't really need it. You don't really need it. Smoothly not. Thanks for the five gifted sub. Thanks. Thanks. Are you going to play Darkest Dungeon 2 again? Nah, not unless there's mods. Not unless, like, a mod thing happened for Darkest Dungeon 2, which probably won't happen anytime soon, given how that game's format is, but... I get, like, trinkets and stuff could happen with mods, but, like, enemies will never really have that much. Not even off-stream? No one ever asks that with that intention <laughs> no one's ever like you gotta play uh darkest dungeon 2 again and they expect me to answer oh yeah off stream for sure no one ever expects that answer and i believe it was already implied by the fact i've been talking about it Cool guy. Thanks for the 10 gifted subs. Thanks. Wow. How, at what point is the intro just stalling because I'm afraid to go into the nightmare? At what, at what point is it just stalling because I worry about the nightmare? 
Isn't it always stalling? Bro, it's gonna be bad, chat. Dude, it's it's gonna be bad. I don't, I really need to stress again. Uh, we're using an item randomizer, an enemy randomizer, and a fog gate randomizer. The fog gate one is the important one. Uh, we're also using Elden Ring Reforged, uh, which changes the balance in some of the gameplay around a little bit, adds some new things and changes some items, along with an extra couple talismans that change and like are added to the randomizer as well. Um, there's also some new animations for combat, some new anim like some new uh, move sets and stuff. Uh, the fog one though is the big deal for this stream because uh, we're using a mode called Dungeon Crawl, which means the open world is basically not something we can access until we've defeated a major boss through the dungeons. Uh, so all of the <laughs> I, I've ticked all of the options for this. Uh, we're gonna randomize it live so you guys know that I'm doing a fresh run with no bullshit. Uh, I'll show the windows when I do it. But <clears throat> I've ticked all of the options, which means every fog gate in the whole game for any catacombs, any tunnel, any fucking cave any weird graveyard hole uh loops it can connect to another spot it does make a logical web like a like a metroidvania map it does make a web and it records it on a spoiler sheet so i can technically track it but it's not exactly supposed to have everything connected. That's no version of this I've seen comes with like everything ticked. It's usually been like one or like maybe like half of the options ticked. We've ticked everything. Now I hate some of these zones. I hate the catacombs. I think catacombs fucking suck. But in the interest of truly making this as miserable for myself as possible and as impossible to navigate as I can, there will be catacombs. We will have to traverse these nightmares. The only thing I can randomize once we've gotten in game and started our run is enemies. So if I get soft locked hard by an enemy, like a boss is truly too much for me. I can concede and randomize it again. I don't want to do that, but I, I am also keenly aware this is a this is a stream and we could run into something really fucked up like fucking uh Melania, which I think is one of the worst bosses. Uh I right, look, hot take, I think that their boss fight is fucking beans, and I think most of their moveset is fucking shit. Uh and I don't want to fight them. So uh, if I ran into them and they weren't immediately obviously defeatable as a result of the scaling, uh, I'd probably roll that one. There are, the randomizer does let you turn off their healing, which is something, but honestly, I just think that their fucking like water foul, whatever the fuck it is, like super move is just a fucking obnoxious pain in the ass to dodge and ruined the whole fight for me. It's really just that one move. But uh, it is so dumb, and I just can't, I just can't. <laughs> you can tell me a billion times, like, you gotta switch, you gotta do this. You just gotta switch to this item. You need to be, like, you gotta take off half your armor. You gotta change your entire build. The only way you can win is if you change your whole build and play style. Uh, equals a badly designed boss that was only designed for one play style, which is bad design for a game with, uh, you know, a vast array of playstyles and build options. We don't like those. I don't like those. Dude, I fucking, obviously it's gonna be, it's not, no, I don't, you know, I don't even need to warn people for spoilers for fucking Elden Ring anymore. Malaketh was the same fucking deal. I played like a heavy strength build when I first got to Malaketh. And that was like a boss fight where it was like, oh yeah, you played a slow character. 
played a slow character to swing slow, huh? You fucking idiot. You fucking moron. What, are you kidding me? Better switch. Switch your weapon. You'll never, you're never gonna hit him if you don't switch your weapon. So switch your weapon. Switch it. <laughs> switch your weapon. Imagine not being a dex user, Omega Lull. Imagine outing yourself as a dex user and Omega Lulling publicly in the same message. Yikes! Yikes, man! Holy shit! Damn! Ruffle if you put a point in a non-arcane stat. Yeah, but like, ruffle if you put any points in arcane before arcane worked. Yeah, but like... Do you remember the part, the part where arcane didn't work? <laughs> Do you remember that, Raffle? Do you remember the part where, where Arcane was a broken stat and didn't do anything? That had no skill. Like, you're talking from the perspective of someone that has played Elden Ring recently. I was there on perhaps ground zero, like many, many other people. And as a result, Arcane, cool as its weapons were, were, um, well, useless. Uh, they were all useless. They were literally useless. Dude, it's wild that it took like actually a week for FromSoft to patch something that was probably a single typo in like the code. That it took so long to patch our game. <laughs> It took so long. Like, I beat the whole game before they patched that stat. The whole time I was like, I want to kind of, I kind of want to play that, kind of want to play that stat. And then it took, they never did it. Like, you'd think something that, dude, honestly, you know what it reminds me of? I saw patch notes like a month or two ago for Cruelty Squad. Like, the first patch notes the game had had in like a year and a half. And all the patch notes said was, turns out there was an it, like there was a issue in the code. And armor works now. Up until now, armor has never worked. No armor in the game has actually given you any buff. So armor in Cruelty Squad up until two months ago just slowed your character down, which is actually fucking extremely extremely like honestly dude i didn't notice i thought it was fucking i thought that the armor was doing something all i needed was the placebo to tell me that i was stronger and i felt more confident and better about myself like i, I you could have told me that armor was working forever and i would have believed it Inversely, speed buffs also didn't make you take more damage. Yeah, it was just a. It was all those kinds of. Dude. Fucking hell. Cruelty Squad is. I. Damn it, dude. I want to play as Cruelty Squad again. Fuck. Fuck, dude. Every day I'm alive. Rerun stream pug. I mean, to be fair, Cruelty Squad, when I streamed it was still in early access. They added like six levels to that game and like like tw like 12 or 13 new weapons and a ton of new stuff from like the point where I streamed it to like when I actually, when I actually like fully finished. Stream it please. No chat, it's just not a very good stream game. I don't think, I think when people see that game, 
blood pours out of their eyes and they need to make it known in the chat. They need to make it known. Yet you play Urge. Listen, chat, I mean... I can, but... I mean, to be entirely frank, and, like, this is, like, a genuine thing, and it's a logic a lot of variety streamers use for returning to games, so don't take it personally when I say this, but this is how it usually goes. Um, when I played Cruelty Squad last time, it was it underperformed. Like, it deeply underperformed. So it's one of those things where it's like, yeah, people say they're going to watch it, but even then when people didn't even know what it was, it deeply underperformed. So it's like me streaming it again is me taking a chance on something that where I could stream something else that would likely do better. And, you know, I already know it wasn't compete. I wasn't like streaming at the same time as like an esports tournament. All right. <laughs> I, I would have known. So it, it, people just didn't want to watch it and that's fine. But like, you know, when something deeply underperforms to a certain degree, there's not much reason to stream it when I have a dozen other things I could stream that I know people more would more widely enjoy. And like, love it or hate it, that is one of the pillars of being a good variety streamer is knowing which battles you want to fight as far as like, oh, people, people might not like this one as much, but I want to play this. Or, oh, I should play this one because a bunch of people would prefer this. Like, you know, that's just something you have to accept. You know? Who knows? But, like, that is... That is... Those are considerations. You know? You just kind of have to. Pool it, then? There's, uh, no such thing as a beneficial poll on Twitch for actually judging, uh, interest in something. <laughs> I'm just... I'm just telling you now. There's, uh, there's no reason to do that. <laughs> Literally zero. Listen, I'll just break it down for you now. Uh, it's never it, it's never happened because I don't do those kinds of things. I'm not like one of those streamers like, guys, would you show up if I streamed this game? Of course you're going to fucking say you'd show up. It doesn't cost you anything right now to say, yeah, dude, I'd be there. That sounds rad. But when the time comes, when you're actually down to the wire, okay, you don't owe me anything. <laughs> <laughs> you don't owe me anything. <laughs> Whatever any streamers like, guys, who's going to show up if I stream this? And like a bunch of people in chat are like, fuck yeah, dude, I'll be there. I'm sitting there quietly shaking my head because I see all those people and I know they don't owe that streamer a single fucking thing. And when the time comes, they'll make it known. <laughs> That's why I like polls and all that shit don't matter and why I don't do them. Because like people, people will use their time how they please. No one's going to blame them for that. It's really easy to be like, dude, fuck yeah. <laughs> I'll, I'll be there, dude. I will fucking be there. When, like, you don't have to be there <laughs> right now. You know? There's so many variables. All right. Tomato Business Analytics Gaming. Uh, whether streamers want to tell you it or not, whether they ever want to actually admit it or if they want to fucking... Or if they're one of the wildly, wildly rare people that just didn't fucking care and somehow fumbled and bumbled their way all the way to fully successful, uh, most streamers have to care about this stuff. Especially if you're a variety streamer. <laughs> you kind of ha It is your job. Uh, it is a business. Pretty sure Jerma just does what he wants. Nah, he knows what he's doing. And it's, it's unrealistic and unfair. And, like, it, he knows what he's doing. 
Like, it, you gotta be out of your mind to be like, nah, he's just fucking fumbling. He's just falling upwards and like, whatever the fuck. Like, no, he knows what he's fucking doing. He knows the business. Most successful streamers know the business to some extent. You know? Yeah, we're gonna get into it though. Look, I'm just trying to keep it. I'm trying to keep it real for all of you, you see, because I'm just trying to keep it real for all of you. For some reason, there's a stigma to acknowledging that economics and strategy is important to streaming. Dude, this is a super com like this market, <laughs> this industry is very competitive. Especially live streaming, where you are literally competing for the attention of a single person who could choose to put that attention somewhere else. You know? Like, it's... You have to be a wild, like, anomaly to not have to care about that stuff at all or acknowledge it ever. And still, like, find success, I think. Like, not everyone has to, inv like, has to invest to the same degree, but you can't just fucking... You can't just not do. You can't just not care. You know. Anyways, uh, I'm done talking about this because we have to play the video game chat. We have to. We do have to play. We do have to. It is time. Why? Uh, well, chat, I've been labeled as playing Elden Ring for the last hour. And, um, once you've done that, technically, I am legally obligated to switch to the game. Or I will face actual punishment. I will face actual punishment. So... Again, we are playing with a item randomizer, an enemy randomizer, a fog gate randomizer, and some mods that change the way the balance of the game works. Uh, the only thing we'll be able to change once we're in is the enemy randomizer. Everything else is going to be locked in once we randomize it. I've already got my settings in place. I will show them to you right now. It's going to be a little small because, uh, you know, these are small windows. I can't really make them any larger. But, um, they're here. So we have, you can just take a peek at this if you're interested with what I'm actually using for settings. Uh, we're using the unalloyed uh, mod pack for most of the setup. But if you actually want to use the fog gate randomizer with it, you'll have to follow the manual settings to set it up uh, on the um, mod nexus page. You Literally, it won't work if you use like the automatic setup. You have to manually make the entire mod pack from scratch using like their instructions, essentially. So, uh, that's that was fun. That took a little bit. That was a little bit complicated, but we did get. I got there. Uh, but yeah, most of this is just most of this part is normal old enemy item randomization. We will be rolling this first, and then we'll do the fog gate one. I'll explain the fog gate one. But the item one is, I'm just re-rolling it on stream so people know that I'm doing this fresh. Uh, so there's no, there's no question of he fabricated some bullshit. I'm doing it all. I'm resetting all of it. It might crash. Sometimes it spits out an error in one of these two. And if it does, we have to re-roll both. Uh, so we may have to re-roll this one still. He still has a D drive. Dude, D drive is where I keep all my games, man. I always use the D drive. Is there something wrong with that? All right. So the fog gate randomizer is the one that's really going to curse this the fuck up. We're using dungeon crawl. Technically, you can use world shuffle, which gives like, uh, which makes it so you can actually like traverse the open world zones. Uh, we're not, I don't want to do that. We're going to do one called dungeon crawl which means all of the dungeons and interior zones are connected by fog gates. You can't access open world zones unless you've defeated one of like the major bosses and then accessed the world zone from behind them, essentially. Uh, we have every single zone in the entire game ticked on. That means all the catacombs, the tunnels, 
underground cities, caves, heroes, graves. I don't fucking remember what the fuck those even are, but those are in there too. Uh, yeah, we, I, it's going to be bad. The chariots. Yeah. 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 It's going to be, I, I, listen, chat. I didn't say it was going to be fun for me. <laughs> Listen, chat. Some streamers play their randomizers to have fun. I'm doing it because I want to, like, I want to really push it. I want to see how much pain I can really, like, endure before I snap. Like a, like a twig. So, we can't re-roll this part. Once these two things are locked in, they are locked in for good. Enemy randomizer, we can re-roll if stuff gets bad and I get soft-locked enemy-wise. Everything else is locked in. Now! Here's your job once we randomize. Oh, hang on. We're going to have to re-roll it. This, this, okay, so this seed's busted. Uh, this one here. So we're going to roll it one more time and see if it works. Sometimes the fog one can spit out errors pretty regularly. So we just keep rolling it. And eventually they'll either come out with something. Okay, it's come out with enough now that we need to re-roll this side. Eventually this will work. It just sometimes it takes a minute to find one that uh, lands. Before, uh, because you know, this is there's a lot going on in this one chat, so bear with me. Already broken, I mean, when you see the amount of shit that is changed in order to like do this, you'd be like, Oh, yeah, <laughs> that adds up. Okay, it makes sense that errors would get spat out. All right, we're gonna have to roll it again, again. We just keep rolling. We can turn back on the music for now while we do this part. Yeah. Elden Ring is not a small game. It's honestly kind of... Yeah, see, this time it spat out one here. Eventually, we'll just hit that fucking thing where it just works. You just keep hitting the lever, and eventually it spits one out. I can also make it a little bit easier on the game by, like, dialing back some of the randomized crap. Specifically on the dungeon crawl side. I just don't want to. I just don't really... I just don't really want to. Okay, that side's done again. Try rolling this. Man. I might have to take off one of these things. I think we've added too many different things. I think... If we take off catacombs... Actually, let's take off Heroes Graves and see if that fakes it, like fixes it. Okay, I fixed it. <laughs> we are not doing the chariots. We have removed the hero's graves. I think we were reaching the maximum amount of logic gates it could add to the map before overloading the randomizer. <laughs> okay, that fixed it. Okay. Uh oh. My trumpet tipped over. Why? Okay, so... Warning, you'll need to visit the open world to collect some key items to avoid this with item ran randomizers like dungeon crawl mode there and make sure the selected locations match between the randomizers. Dungeon crawl mode. Fog gate enabled. Let me uh, just, uh, okay. Places where a uh, cl place that counts as an important location. Golden seed. We might have to untick gold seed. I think that might be the problem. Because that's open world. One last roll! Get excited, folks! Roll the dice! Roll the dice! Hit the lever! Yeah, we can access the open world in Dungeon Crawl. It just requires us, like, exploring really thoroughly after we've accessed it. So, like, it'd be a lot of, like, scouring through open... I don't want open world to have any actual requirements for progression. Okay, that side's done again. So now we re-randomize this one more time, and we should be good. Most players stop randomizing before they get the roll. True. Okay, it's just spitting that out, even though it even though it's not true. Is uh, that or it's telling me this because of these? 
I might need to set these two to important look. Oh, yeah, it's probably this. Yeah, it's this one. These need to be set to important location. Because uh, otherwise it would be open world for flask upgrades and uh, uh, the bells. Okay. See, now this makes sense. There's a preset for the randomizer for this mod pack. And I ignored some of the settings, even though they were set to this. I ignored them. That means we can have heroes' graves back on. Listen, I will roll this one more time! Hit the lever! And then we'll try to turn back on heroes' graves. We'll give it one chance, okay? We'll give it one chance. We will try one time. Play Cruelty Squad instead. Don't tempt me. Hero's Grave. Enabled. Reroll. You want to know what I think it is? Hero's Graves only have, like, one entrance. Like, there's not, like... I I, I don't know. I think that Hero's Graves are, like, just a fucked thing that shouldn't exist. I, I, I think they're, like, doomed. It's not possible. Hero's Graves are fucked. And honestly, and honestly, okay, yeah, no, that definitely, come on now, get there, that one, that seed was just a bad seed, I think if we do, I think Hero's Graves can work, it's just the seed is so specific that we'll never actually, okay, this thing's still telling me I have open world items for key items, I think that's just spitting it out. I think that's just spitting it out, even though it's not true. Uh, I think we're good. We're not gonna. We're gonna. We, we, we're gonna be fine. Everything's fine. Let's get in there. We're good. We'll get in there. This is good. We're cashing out. We're running it. It's time. We'll be fine. It spits out the warning regardless. Source, I made this mod pack. Wait, really? I don't believe you. Unless you did. I mean, you're like a... Dude, anyone can say that, though. Dude, I don't know, man. Hang on. No, I made it. Check the author on the Nexus. What the heck? Dude, what are the odds? That's like the second time that someone that's like a regular in the chat that I recognize has made some mod or mod pack that I'm using for a stream. What are the odds? It's crazy. Well, then if it doesn't fucking work, it's your fault. Uh, going forward. Now that I know. All right. It's time. New game. Now these are some good looking characters. Let's see what they really look like. Underneath the... <laughs> Damn. Damn. What the? What the heck? Looking good. The hero looking nasty. Bandit looking like a looking a little silly. The uh, the astrologer. The what the fuck even? What the hell is the prophet even doing? I mean, that's a look, right? Whoa, hang on, what is up with the color correction? Hang on. Why is, why, oh no, is, is it? Hang on, I'm gonna crank this up a little. There's some weird, there's some weirdness happening with Elgato a little bit. I'm gonna have to fucking wiggle it around. Okay, that fixed it. It's a little dark. The gamma sometimes gets fucked up and I don't know why, but I think that fixed it. 
you have HDR enabled? No. No. Samurai actually gets a katana. The samurai, this samurai got spat out pretty decent. Actually, <laughs> how the heck, what are the odds? It's 26 starting dexterity. I mean, imagine being a dex build though, when you could play the prisoner or the confessor or the nasty guy. You could, I mean, like, I mean, I can't play the fucking nasty guy, right? Can't play the nasty guy. Naked or no balls. Chat, I, uh, chat, there's all these random characters with special wands and rings and nasty guy just gets a tree branch and I'm pretty sure that ring kills you. <laughs> I think that ring just fucking kills you if you wear it. I think it kills you. He has a sword. And one eight, and one level. <sighs> bring the gold, bring the prawn, dude. Bring a boiled prawn, dude. Bring the prawn. All right, if that's the case, I'm taking a golden seed as my starting item. <laughs> I'm, t I'm getting an extra flask buff if I'm gonna do that. This is gonna be a struggle stream? I mean, yeah. Hang on, I need to... I wish I had checked, uh, like my, uh, my mistake is that I'm on the old fucking setup. So, um, my, some of my visual settings have been like, when Elgato starts sometimes it fucks up and it has like a weird lighting issue. I think I've gotten it fixed now. It's, yeah, it's green. No, that's just how the game looks. The game has a piss filter behind it, even on my screen. Uh, but um, I had to adjust it a little bit before we started. I should have checked because uh, if I restart, it usually fixes the problem, but I can't restart the, uh, the stream. Okay, I'm gonna fuck up this character bad, hang on. Uh, let's see here. We're just gonna go ahead and grab this and grab the face structure. We're gonna grab a- where's the templates? Yup, just do that. I guess I'll just do similar face until something good comes out. That's how we do this, right? We love that? The similar face in this one's a little, uh... It's a little slow. But he's getting there. <laughs> he's slowly getting there. It just takes a fucking minute. But he's getting there. A little bit more of that and we'll... Oh, wait, he's getting sad. Oh, wait, no, he's coming back around. No, he's getting sadder. A little bit more of that and... Oh, not there. <laughs> Alright. I like it. I like it. Hair. All. Eyebrows. All. Facial hair. All. <laughs> Damn, man. <laughs> that the saddest big baby I ever saw in my life. Uh, how small can I make them? That's the saddest big baby I ever saw. Big head. Like small. Arms small. Abdomen small. 
It's a shame that the head cannot, the chest cannot support big head. <laughs> Without, you know, certain things being adjusted. It's such a shame every time. Age? Old. Aged voice? Oh, sorry, by the way, I'm not using fucking keyboard and mouse. I'm using a PS5 controller, but there's no, like, wildly, there's no UI adjustment for it, so it just doesn't recognize it. What's, like, the, is it, what's this? Uh. <laughs> Alright, we got there. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and name this guy, um... Uh, let's see, uh, yeah, I'm gonna name him, uh, Bert. Bert Bumble. Okay. We got there. Let's get in there. B name. It's always a name with you guys, isn't it? There's always some... Let's see if I crash. Something horrible happens. Arise. Skip this shit. Important for technical reasons, please enable show tutorials in your sound and display settings to guarantee proper function of Elden Ring Reforged. That ring is really actually killing me. The ring I'm wearing is actually killing me. I don't have time for this! What is this thing? Heals upon attacking and hemorrhaging enemies, but constantly drains HP. What the fuck is this? A sacrificial twig. And here we just have a long sword. With the classic ability square off. Yeah, I don't remember it being like this. I don't remember this being... <laughs> Dark Bert, dude. What the fuck happened? <laughs> Bert, what the fuck? Whoa, whoa! Fucking <laughs> 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 face. Mother of God. Well, the long sword's better. That's cool. Oh, I got my items. The long- I got a good longsword, I guess. It's epic. <laughs> Hang on, is there like- Whoa! Whoa! Bert! Wait! Whoa! Whoa! Hold up. Whoa! Bert! What the hell's going on? Powerful warrior emerges from the church, ready to face what this world has to offer, despite the fact he truly, literally doesn't have access to uh, most of the video game's map. And never will. I don't know, there's no items up here, right? I don't even, I don't remember. This pisses me off, by the way. Um, I don't know why the fuck from software has like an addiction to putting doors you can kind of see through, but yet you can't do anything with every time. It pisses me the fuck off. Oh, by the way, we need to find a torch or a light source, which is good that we have this sword. The caves are all really dark. <laughs> Any cave zone is really dark. Uh, so uh, we might just be in the shadow world uh, a lot of the time. So we need to find a torch or some kind of light source. Okay, guys, let's get ready. Here comes the boss fight. Is what I would say if this was one. I don't want to be here. Can we pick a different starting zone? 
Can I not do fucking Farum Azula as my start? Can we skip this? Hang on. Can we bad seed reset the fucking thing? Like, if I go back through this, we can technically reset the whole fog gate cycle. I can just close the game, reset the fog gate. We'll get to keep everything else as long as we start at the into. Oh, maybe it won't be that bad. Dude, I fucking hate Farum Azula. But whatever, I do have- I do have fucking dark Burt, dude. We might be okay. Every time I close- I end the move, he does that. Okay, well... Maybe it won't be that bad. Chat. Okay, you can't actually use that setting. I'll let it be known. I clicked a check. I was curious. I can't. <laughs> Just wanted to know. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and add a charge to my flask. Uh, okay. Well, maybe it's not. Let's check outside. I feel like I have to walk everywhere like this, you know? None of the idiots up here know I'm Dark Bert. They have no idea the power I wield. Wait, what the fuck was all that? <laughs> Wait, I picked that up without looking. Okay, that's cool. So there's a bell that lets me return to the start. I'm guessing the start means all the way back to the Chapel of Anticipation. So that's good. We have that. Discover common fortunes. What the fuck? This is a new thing. Fortunes. Select fortune. We have no fortunes. Divine a fortune. With the shop menu, I don't... That don't matter. Fortune of the Barbarian. Okay, so I can see the... I can pick a fortune for my character, like a build. Fortune of the Commoner. I'm not picking that. I've already punished myself enough. Increases maximum stamina. Raises target priority. Heals on hit, depending on the strength of the hit. The potency of the healing effect. Okay, so that's a heal when I damage people. Fortune of the Rogue. Recovery speed and decreases target priority. Fortune of the wizard. Uh, okay. Fortune of the ranger. Item discovery, duration of buffs. Fortune of the cleric, artificer, warlock, sorcerer, paladin. I need movement speed. Skill FP cost decreases stamina consumption of attacks. Increases mine spells casting spells boost the power of me. I don't have any spells <laughs> I think I, the only one that's smart is I take fighter or paladin just because they're gonna help me now. I Think I have to take fighter or paladin or I'm gonna get owned Because ranger increases my move speed, but only if I have a Bow in my hand, so I think it's fighter or paladin Performing successful deflect restores a small amount of stamina. What the fuck? That is what the f what the heck? Now what the heck and heck is that? Let's just take fighter. We're gonna. Oh, I accidentally managed to leave. I think it's a parry, but like a funny parry. I think it's a mod thing. All right, we're gonna lock in fortune of the fighter, which is a common fortune. Okay, guys, I'm feeling lucky. Let's get out there. Yes. Okay, chat. So, here's the thing. In this shithole, you are... If I ask, and you know the direction of one, tell me where the fuck, like, the fog gates are. Because I really don't know where they fucking are out here. I, re I literally don't know. I, I hate this place. I hate for... It's not that... This isn't that bad, though. Okay, the sword does damage. What the fuck? What the fuck? You could step up to me, to the great bird? Sword attack! I need to come up with a better name for it than that, actually. I do need to come up with a better name for it than sword attack. Fire Blossom, and who fucking cares about crafting materials? Is this like a good item? <laughs> y 
Yo! Oh, it covers my sad face. Well, there's a lot of dust out here, and I am allergic to dust, so. Drop it. Yes. <laughs> what creature could dare step up to me? Skeleton with a with a with a bow. Prepare yourself for the thrashing of a lifetime. What the fuck? What am I hearing? Was oh! an attempted assassination. Dude, why does my guy do so much damage on his punt? Hold up. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Dude! Bert's a bit of a badass. $400. Damn, Bert. What the heck? Crap. Some kind of knight. Some kind of big ant. All living in harmony. I don't think there's even an item. Chat, look, here's it. Oh, I do need that. We need items? I don't really care about killing right now. I just... Yeah. I just want to get the... Yeah. I just want to get the items. Oh, fuck. Yeah. We can all be peaceful. Now we get the fuck out of here. Oh, 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 oh. oh fuck! Oh fuck the crap! Oh! 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 A shadow is creeping over the fucking landscape! You have no idea how power- Oh! I tried to take it down with, uh, with punching. I tried to take it down with a... Talisman effects that prevent... Pres oh, that was my... That was my sacrificial twig that I didn't unequip. Ah, well. I do have this ring. Let's see how much d this heals me for if I hit someone. Maybe we just tear through this place. <laughs> Not enough to keep me alive! <laughs> 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 I forgot there was a, like, suicide jar just fucking out there. Where the fuck is this one? I can't even... I, it's just sitting right there, the asshole. Freak. Damn, I wish this did more damage. Ow! Ha! <laughs> Pathetic. Hang on, I gotta do something important. Oh yeah, I won't need my... Oh god, that snail's coming. I won't even need to, like, set up... ...my horse, because I'll never be able to summon them here. It's too bad. I gotta set up point down, do you mind? I gotta set up point down. Oh! Oh! Did you just fucking poison me? You have no idea the darkness I have within me. There was no, I, dude, I'm, we're gonna reset it because I'm gonna run by that bomb guy. I wanna bring him with me. I have a good feeling about an idea of mine. Check this one out. Chase me! Oh, he killed himself. Fuck. That sets me back greatly. Oh, what the fucking hell is happening? This can't be it. This can't- Oh, this can't be how this happens. This can't be- This can't be the place. This can't be the starting zone. This can't be the starting zone. I can't be forced to do this. Ugh. Ugh. I can't clear this place. 
Give me an epic item right now. <laughs> the the man, the punches are better. Get out of my fucking way. Give me that. Oh, the crap! Oh. Give me this. That's good. Give me that. Lost him. I can't see. I mean you no harm. But if you come any closer, I will have to defend myself. Okay, hang on. Could I use that dash to, like, fucking skip things? I need to check. Model necklace plus one. <laughs> what, pray tell? <laughs> Dude, it boosts all the worst, most useless things in the game. Wait, 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 wait. What is, what is robustness and union concentration? I actually don't remember, because they're all, they're all just words to me. What the fuck are these again? Resistance to ailments. Oh, wait, no, that's good. Every ailment. Okay, no, no, okay, actually, that's really good. Okay, wait, wait, okay, I see bars moving. I get it now. All right, well, uh, let's see if I remember how the fuck Furumazula works. I think I gotta jump on this thing. I fucking, God, I fucking hate this place. Have I said that 13 times yet? I fucking hate this place. I don't even know where the hell I'm going when I do this map. This place sucks. You're not my friend. Hang on, where's my friend who's supposed to be here? You're not him. Last time I did this randomizer, there was an Alexander guy here, and I was like, oh, dude, it's just like Alexander, and I got all excited, and then he tried to kill me, and then he threw himself off a cliff and died. Now it's just a fucking octopus. I'm taking this. Okay, that seems like a cool thing. Prepare yourself! Wait, why am I fighting this idiot? I don't want to die. Oh, that's not a jump. <laughs> don't! I have to be careful with the fights I choose. That was the actual Alexander. Yeah, well, he was deeply aggressive. Oh, wait, he's hiding under there. Because he's a coward. Damn. I mean, I don't know where the fog gates are, but I know there's not one here yet. But I think if I get down there, there's one. I would just have to do some shimmy. Dude, chill. You have no idea the darkness within me, and I will unleash it upon you if I fucking must. Okay? So relax. No! Oh! I live. I lived. All these people mean me, mean like, you know, they have bad intentions. So I think what I'm gonna do is. Yoink? We're gonna level up off of runes for now because fighting people is well just just foolish just a foolish endeavor at level one What the <laughs> oh. oh I can't even go back this way I have to climb Fuck 
dude. I don't remember that. I hated Furumazula, dude. I never came back here. This place sucked. I fucking hate this place. Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, 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 oh! I can't get out! Oh, oh! You fucking asshole! You're right, you're the rock just within me! Banished to the shadow realm by my blade! Don't! It does the forced dash no matter what, it's dangerous. Alright, we're fine. Well, chat, I know that I know that the randomizer said there's 269 gates, I believe. You asshole. You're not gonna get me twice with that. So, uh, and I know, yeah, that is nice. But also simultaneously, oh fuck, it's happening, I'm gonna die. I need to get down. To get down from here. Oh fuck! Get lost! I don't think the fucking- Oh! He did! He did! I didn't think the pot would jump down. I really, I really didn't think the pot would jump down. All right, well, hey, look, here's the thing. We got ourselves 4,000 souls. We're gonna level up here. Get ourselves a little something something. I know what the level up menu is, game. I'm not a fool. Now, I don't want to invest in like Dex or Int or Strength or Arcane or Faith yet. Or Int, any of them. Uh, because I don't know what my build is going to be. I am going to br bring up my health and my endurance and my mind a little bit. Just to get a baseline. Until I figured out what the fuck I'm actually doing. Because once we- it won't be hard to get XP once we find like some idiot NPC that spawned next to a cliff and falls infinitely forever over and over again. So I'm not too worried about that. You know? I just want to make sure that I, I won't instantly die when things hit me for an hour. God, it's fucking dark. Doesn't help that Elgato is making things darker again. You know what I think that implies is I need to rip it out of the fucking PC and plug it back in after the stream. It's not too bad, though. But it is a little bit more contrasted than it should be. Looks fine. Oh, I know it looks fine, but like, I see the comparison from what it should look like to what it looks like for all of you, and it looks fine for you because it's just a little bit more contrast. But, uh,. Technically, it's not what I want it to be. It's like I'm just seeing something that's the image it should be, and you guys are seeing an image that also works, but isn't what I want it to be, essentially. So it's not like a problem, but uh, I don't like seeing it on my side. Stop. There's like too much shading. Yeah, but if I never brought it up, you'd never notice. Like that's that's the thing at the end of the day, is that it is a minor thing. I need to jump down there. <laughs> that's the that's the way I'm gonna try to go forward. I remember I vaguely remember this. <laughs> oh, these guys don't have AI yet because I haven't activated the thing, so I'm just gonna skip up. Okay, Chad, here's the plan. We just need to keep descending down. That's all. Forgot about that. Well, we need to get that item anyways. See, good news is we have this glow stick. You know? That thing's coming for me. That thing's coming for me. No, 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 that thing was turning towards me. Who the hell is that idiot? Glint stone pebble. Neat. 
Where's the jump? <coughs> Alright, we're never coming back here again, dude. I don't care if there's items. I mean, actually, there is, like, a bunch of items I can get, like, up there. I can go up to that as well and go, like, down. If we need items at some point, we need to look around. We should go up there. Because that's easy to do. It's not a bad run. We'd have to backtrack quite a bit. What the? You have no idea! The Ow! Fuck! <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> That's not my guy's special move! There it is. I'm gonna break right through that fucking armor! Power Slam! Wait, I really do have one! Huh? Oh! Oh! Die! Oh shit, hang on. Pathetic. Fire Monk's prayer book. And some blood. Very cool. I should probably go level up with these souls I got before I, uh, do anything else. Chat, I- I pointed down, that's worth a couple pogs, right? That's worth a couple of pogs. Smithing stone. Alright. We're gonna level up. I'm gonna do- I like bringing my health to 16, or like 16 or 18 minimum, in these games. I just don't like getting one shot, I'm gonna get one shot a lot more in this one anyways, so... I'm gonna bring it up a little bit more. Oh, you just respawn! Oh, you're just normal! Alright, gruesome twosome, let's- Huh? Hello? <laughs> yes. We'll come back here. I just need to... There's some items still in that zone. I'd like to go check and see if I can get them. Not up on the top, but like... But like, at, uh, like around the corners. Plus chat. There's two entrances into this arena. The other one might be another pathway to another zone. Just for the record. I think that might actually be a thing. So I do need to check where that one goes. <laughs> Never turn your back on Bert. There's, there's like three entrances or some shit. Yeah, there's one here. Does this all- This is an important test we're about to do, chat. Does this- Dude, who the hell's this idiot? <laughs> nice hat. Does this take me to Nakron? If these all take me to Nakron, that simplifies things. If it doesn't- Nah, man, that ain't a snail. <laughs> Last I checked, you ain't a snail at all. Oh! 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 oh. You're not a snail! You're not a... Oh, that's... Oh! It's an imposter because there is a snail. Yeah, but what if I do pick that? I feel like I'm not allowed to do Stakes of Marika because that is going to break it. I think we have to do Last Sight Visited for this. Because if we don't, we are going to break this fucking mod pack by like actually managing to clip into another section of the map. 
that we're not supposed to do in that order. Dude, chill. You're just like an enemy in the video game. Steak should be fine. All right, cool. Then I'll probably try them next. Oh, right. That's not how fucking ledges work. That's just not how they work. What was my guy pulled down by the gravity of like fucking like 10 Earths at the same time? That was so fast. Out of my way. I just want the items, man. <laughs> I'm not going that way again. I don't know why I did that twice. I don't know why I did that twice. Rip runes. Dude, there's nothing more iconic than someone going rip runes to the zero runes on the ground or the 200 runes on the ground. There's nothing more iconic than people thinking there's value in that pile of garbage next to the place I died. Dude, you have to get those runes back, bro! No, I'm... We're okay. Dude, I don't know if I saw Bert do that when you... When, like, you saw him approach, I'd back off. I'd fuck off. The naked guy that was running at you just went like and like fucking activated dark magic. I'm just not so sure about that. Try it. Dude, even the fucking charge does 99 damage. What the fuck? Yo, this longsword is cracked, though, is the thing. Uh, it is a good weapon. Another 400 bucks. I'm just gonna grab all the items around here. Try to find the third entrance. Hey. You really sure you want this? It's okay, I'll just spam attack. Alright, got him. That's a point down. Nah, close that. Wrong button. That's a point down. That's a point down for me. Dude, I just noticed how nasty Bert's, like, tummy is. What the fuck? That is a nasty tummy. Looks like a mouth. Nice. Dude, rip runes, dude, rip runes. Rip runes, dude, he's gotta get those runes, dude. Nah, dude, sorry, I put all my money on gift cards. I don't, I don't need, I don't need the, like the single dollar bills on the ground. I got these gift cards. I can redeem this whenever I want. All right, where's this one take me? I've never struggled against one of these. And I don't know if that's because they're bad or if because I got lucky. Oh, I got lucky. <laughs> I got lucky. I got lucky. It's not, I am bad. I am bad. Oh, 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 oh. I need clothes. Where does this take me? Let's just see. Oh, it just puts me back in. Well, that's actually kind of really good. Oh! Oh! I didn't hear no bell. I didn't hear... I didn't hear no bell. I didn't hear no bell. They get really good at fighting you. <laughs> you have no idea. Dude, that, that my fucking stance is suicide, man. But what about this one? Whoa, that one does damage. Oh! Ow! 
Every time we do this, I get a little better, a little stronger, a little faster. And eventually, you're gonna get owned, motherfucker! Your moves are lame! Ow, ow! Stop teleporting around, you coward! Oh. Gonna whittle you down, son! Dude, stop. Okay, so it's only worth doing the one long range move. I'm trying to find like where I have windows to do my moves that do damage. <laughs> this guy kinda spooky, he is kinda spooky. Whoa, 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 he's up! I lived. We're gonna be okay. I fucking actually got hit by it twice, huh? He's not doing anything. We can find peace in our times. Are we good? Whoa, 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 wait, 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 oh. What is he up to? His AI is like all weird now. Oh, my move doesn't have any, I don't got juice in it anymore. Hang on, I gotta take a sippy. Now you're fucked. Stop running from me! You're a coward! You know what? That's it, fine. You fucking asshole. You asshole. You didn't kill me. You know that, right? And now you've made me activate my kung fu moves. I Done warming up. Get water fouled. Time that guy out. I'm done warming up. <laughs> I get I get hit by the opener every time. <laughs> How many times are we gonna do this, man? Ha! See that? That was a jump move. Ha! See that? Don't, 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 don't. Your moves don't even hurt. It's just the death blight. Chuck move. Yeah, I'm doing it. I remember now. This does more damage than every other move in the fucking video game. No swing in the fucking game matters more than the jump move. Yeah, what you gonna do now? Now that I'm dodging like Link from Legend of... I lived. We're evenly matched, but not for long. Fuck, fuck. I'm fine. He's gonna do that thing again with his brain. Did he predict me? He predicted me. Ha! God. God. Do the brain move. Do the move with your weird bug brain. You freak. Yeah. Yeah, what's up? He's scared of me. I don't know why I always, I always dodge backwards like an idiot. Whoa, you got a lot of reach on that, man. Don't! Why did I jump like fucking Link from Legend of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom for my dodge? Why didn't I roll? The roll has iframes. I don't know why I did that. I just, dude, I want to find a way to, this move is like the fucking, the stance is so cool, but it's so useless. It's so bad. 
<laughs> doesn't do anything. It's not good. Ugh. Do your fucking bug move! Coward! Get environmental blocked, dude. Whoa! Hey! This ends! Right now! Oh! 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 Not the green! Not the... Jump move! Alright. This was a dead end. Probably was. What the? All right, bye. All right, I'm gonna go kill the snail too because those are two bosses just in like the zone that I can kill. Dude, I have to get home? I have XP, I have souls on me. Wait a minute. Okay, I can go from there. Don't touch me. I, I, I'm, I, I'm carrying money. Give me that. No one mind me. I'm carrying 10,000 souls on me. I gotta kill this guy. Oh! We clashed, but I won. Yo! Damn. Bert. What the hell's going on, Bert? Bert's looking good, dude. Bert, uh... Bert really popped off. So this takes me to snail zone. That takes me to the snail fight. We want to get back to the fucking bonfire. Or as close to it as we can, so we can... Excuse me! Don't. Don't you fucking do it. Okay. 16. That's what I like. Uh, set my stamina to 16 as well. That's just what I like. Uh, mind. We'll bring that up to... 12. And we'll put one point into... Well, honestly, strength and dex both have to be taken up to like 16 too. Because, um, you know. Yeah, you know, every move, every weapon and item in the game uses it a little. So, uh, we just have to start pumping those. All right. Let's go kill the snail. We know there's a snail in the room. We just have to find them. All right? We know there's a snail. We just have to take their life. Oh, wait. They're right there. Excuse me. I can still see it. It didn't move. Dude, he's not- Yo, your boss is dumb, man. <laughs> Dude, your boss is dumb as hell, man. What the fuck? <laughs> he's just sitting back and watching. Help him! Help him, dude! Do something! I don't think he wants to. Oh, fuck! Ow! Time to end this, Grave Warden Snail. Thanks. For that. Oh. <laughs> I almost forgot.
too easy. Well, we did um, all that for a golden seed. I mean, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna complain. So next, we gotta go to the city. Can you get soft locked by these dead ends? No. The logic of these. Uh, uh, apparently, I can't. Um, the logic of them does like it, it tells you if there's like a problem with the seed that would cause you to have an issue it does it does logic there's some there's some code to make sure that doesn't happen there's always a couple entrances and exits to places all right strength we'll keep bringing it up for a little bit did up to like 13 to 16. well not, i'm not going to use my gift cards yet i don't want to <clears throat> Ultimate Frisbee is cringe, dude. Ow, oh, fuck. Ow, oh, fuck. Nakron, the Eternal City. Never thought I'd be back here again. Shall we? There's no telling what dark secrets there are beneath the city now that it's been all messed up and shit. I can make that. Do you want to see something badass? I'm going to jump it with the move. Check this out. Oh! I think I got less distance than just if I had jumped. I think I got less distance than if I had ran and jumped. Actually kind of close though. Yeah, but if I had run and jumped, I would have made it. But do you think that the reason why I didn't, like, do it right was because I, like, technically walked off the edge? My character's momentum wasn't at the full speed of the fucking move? Do you think that's what happened? Like, what if I do it from a little bit farther back? I test it like this. No, it just sucks. Check it out. I'm going to do it this time the right way by just running and jumping. Check this one out. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. A legendary item just for me. That's cool. That's cooler. That's cool. Cool. Dude, I'm just like Melania. The blade of... Fucking kid, kid, We have armor, we have a badass blade. No no replacement weapons if this one, if you ever get bored of it. We have a shield. Dude, I've been like, there's some, I gotta go through my loot. I really do. Like we've got a lot, what is this? Use FP to mark enemy for codex research. Marks a locked on foe for indexing, defeat mark target. For the mark expires, you enter them into the codex for the all-knowing. I don't fucking want to do that. That's mod shit. There, there, there's um that we have a pretty hefty mod that changes a lot of the mechanics of the game. It's a uh, Elden Ring reforged. So that's probably from that. Uh, okay. Wait, what's the usable item I have here? <clears throat> don't care. Don't care is lame. Just don't care. Not gonna fall for that twice, all right? Here we are. Nakron. The spooky city. Yeah, this place is cursed. Good news is there's not a lot of enemies in this place, last I recall. So it should be a pretty easy in and out. That's an item over there if I just make this jump! 
Huge. I was always really good at the parkour of this game. Rune arc? I mean, I'll take it. Eventually, I'll have the power to use that. This rat never shuts up. That thing has the power of dark madness within it. It's bad. Oh, it's lost. It's mine. It didn't even drop anything. What the fucking wizard? It dares attack me, Bert? Okay, asshole, I... I am gonna close the gap. Here I come. Okay. Let me heal before, and then I'm coming over. Here I come. Yeah, you got fucking aim hacks, okay? That's cool. Ah! <laughs> Vanquishing an enemy group will replenish your flasks. That's cool. Uh, th was this a group? <laughs> Fancy seeing you here, brother! <laughs> I'm talking about the spooky guy in the front, not the crab. Just so you all know. Brother! Okay, hold up. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I don't even think I can win, dude. That guy's crazy. That's a that's the baleful shadow. That's like a boss. You're not even real. <laughs> it's a fucking, you're a randomized enemy. You're not supposed to be here. He's gonna try to jump to me and he's gonna fall. I'm gonna body block him, watch this. This is a classic maneuver. Any minute now, he's gonna do a jump and he's gonna fumble it. And he's gonna slip. I just realized I basically killed myself by activating my move because now I have to do the dash and I'm on this little What did I fucking tell you was gonna happen? You know, I gotta point down quick Pathetic <laughs> What I fucking tell you was gonna happen Do you think I don't know what's going on? Do you think I'm not dialed in? To the gamer first? I am I'm in it. I'm there. Hang on, I wanna check some things. I've been getting like a... I got like a good incantation earlier. I also have Thop's Barrier, which I mean like, I don't fucking care about. But I do care about this. Damn, man, I got some I got some of the big moves. I got some of the big dragon moves. The heck? It's a lot of faith. I've never done a faith build in Elden Ring. Maybe we'll do faith stuff if we get the out uh, the weapons for it. Prepare thyself. I'm not going to fight that crab. I just don't want to fucking do that to myself. So we're skipping them. We'll come back to them maybe one day. Doggy. Oh <laughs> no, no, dude. We got ourselves some glass shards and a, what is that, a faith sword? Int and faith sword. Do you think I'm a, do you think I'm a clown? I'm not doing that. This weapon looks dumb. Dude, I'm gonna be honest. Uh, this weapon looks like beans. Come on. Look at this guy. That's not, look at how embarrassing this is. 
<laughs> did you see what he just did? Like, compare that to this. This is a normal vanilla longsword move. I need to find a faith weapon that does something like this, but larger, because again, this is a vanilla longsword. So if it doesn't do at least what a vanilla longsword does, I'm not gonna use it. What is that bow? Is that a faith bow? <laughs> I feel like the game's trying to tell me something. Can't help but feel like I'm being told something, a kind of build I should be doing. But maybe there's still a chance for it to change its mind. We should give it that chance. We shouldn't assume what the game wants from one or two items. Okay, this room's full of stuff. So let's see if we get anything spicy. First, I want to just see. It's usually, yeah, there's a thing over here. One level one smithing stone. We do need those. I, I haven't unlocked, uh... The round table hold, have I? Don't know when, uh, <laughs> when that's gonna happen, but, um, yeah, that's, uh, something I hope I get soon. There's a setting that has you unlock it by default at the beginning, which means that you do get it eventually. Wonder if you ever will. I should. Well, like two or three fucking sites of grace in the the girl will just show up or something why not i'm definitely gonna have an upgraded weapon eventually for <laughs> for sure i'm gonna get it eventually if i needed it by default with the fog thing it would have automatically enabled with the preset it didn't so we should be able to It's like actual people here. Including one of those nasty boys. That is like the fucking worst model in the game. I hate that guy. Whoa! Damn. I mean, it's no... No longsword. But that's cool. Oh, oh, I almost just ran myself off a cliff. Hello. Dude, chill. I'm gonna try to wave at this guy. I think they might be okay. Hey. I think we're okay. Oh, that's a bomb. Yeah, don't be fooled. That's a bomb. Sometimes I forget. But that was a bomb. Oh, a sight of grace. Ah, yes. This sight of grace will serve us well. And any day now, I am... Hang on. Well, Melina, um, any... Any day now. Uh, you know, any day, any day you feel ready. Um, uh, feel free. Uh, just, uh... Just say it any day now. Taking their time. Taking their time coming to pick me up so I can upgrade my items. Really taking their sweet time. It's cool. I'm not going to be mad. Here we are in Nakron, the Eternal City. We'll just collect all the items and be on our way. Lots of herbs. And melted mushrooms. Wow, there's a lot of dew-kissed herbs in here. Literally made in this. Oh, I loved that meme. That guy, go that shouldn't, that just shouldn't be there. The giant skeleton just shouldn't be there. 
The giant laser death skeleton from hell should not be allowed in a place like this. It's just unacceptable. What, does he fucking see me? No. It's just this idiot. Hey. I knew you had an item. Those bolts are mine. And same with your fucking gift card. $150 Amazon gift card. Big mistake just carrying that around. You never know when a psycho might come by and just- Whoa! This dude was hiding in the fucking bush. Horrid creature. Wait, I missed. Wait. <laughs> I can't miss that move. If I miss that move, then it's the worst move in the entire game. The long sword has the Man, there's something scary behind this behind this building. What the heck? Dude, chill. Oh my god! Oh! Oh, I pissed off everyone. They're all mad at me. Everyone hates me now. Oh, I made them mad. I made them all mad. <laughs> I made him mad. I made him all mad. Dude, who are you? You're nobody. You and me now. Wait, who the, f who the fuck? That guy like actually distracted me. I, dude, there's like a fucking dude emoting at me in the distance. I don't know what's going on. It's that freak from the fucking arena. Oh no. Dude, I don't want any trouble, man. Just leave me alone. He's not gonna. <laughs> He's not gonna fucking leave me alone. Dude, I can't. There was nothing I could do. He's way too powerful. He just kicked me in the neck so hard it broke. He just roundhouse kicked me. Like, I mean, it was a good kick. I'll give it that. I'm gonna go get those souls back. I'm gonna run inside the church, take what's in there, and not clear this place, because this place is hell. Uh, we're gonna- this is gonna be one of those dash-through zones, kinda like, uh, you know, kinda like Farum Azula. Can we watch his stream? Uh, no. No, I'm, a, I'm afraid he... He doesn't stream. Oh, nice! Stop! Mr. Skeleton! Relax! Oh! Faith build? Sure is hard to have a faith build without any spells that are low level for a faith build check. Gonna be a lot of points going into faith without much return for a little bit. Sure is hard to do that stuff without uh, access to the um to the uh, base hub zone. No firelink shrine for me so far. No, no. Where's my ashes? Oh fuck. Your bones. Let's calm down. Oh my god. That item's mine! Thanks for the eggs. Wait, wait, wait. Oh!
I lived. And I got away. Looks like I am the gamer. <laughs> Just you and me now, Thought Gate. Are you gonna take me to a boss? Or are you gonna take me to my destiny? A hundred dollar gift card just sitting on the ground. Small guy. Oh, fuck. Oh, they're bullying me. Stop. Stop. I'm sorry. Your friend is dead now. And you're going to join them. Pants. That was on my wish list on Amazon. I really needed pants. It was weird that they just have like, there's so many like interesting factions in Elden Ring and then there's the nasty boys that are just these nasty, dirty, gross boys who just like rummage around in dirt and they're just small and gross. You know? You guys got an item in there? I am going to take it. It's already mine, fucker. All right, it's already mine. Is an item back here? I just lies. Okay. Do I see that, like, wizard from the fucking academy? Queen Ranala in there? Is that Queen Ranala? That fucking is. I see their stupid hat. It's a good thing I'm not gonna be fighting them in there because it's gonna teleport me out of that room the second I go in. But that would be... That, that would be a nice one. Like, that'd be... I could easily... Yes, right this way. Dude! Actually a pretty good fucking place to put a shop down. I don't remember this being here. Hey man. Welcome, valued customer. Come, please. I'm hungry. Yeah, 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 you're hungry. Uh give me Give me this bell bearing. And also, what do you sell? This dude's selling some cotton, some meat, some low-level smithing stones, some somber smithing stones, a big somber smithing stone, some cookbooks, a cracked pot, crystal tears. I have the flask. I just need to get the tears, so I should get those. Ash of War for Holy Ground. Ash of War for Rain of Arrows. Some pants. And... Someone's private letter. Dude, you can't. That's like a federal crime. You can't be selling that. <laughs> can't sell that. What are these crystals? On, these ones again? Half of one's maximum HP. I mean, what if we run into Mug? It would be good to have this. We should get these. Do I use my Amazon gift cards to buy all these items? Because we have no idea when we're going to be back here. This this is like, we might not, this is a long trip to get back here on this mod. Like the farther we get from a zone, the harder it's going to be to go back because we have to go. Actually, I guess we do have the, we have the grace points. So we don't have to like backtrack fully, but we might not remember. Uh, we'll get this one. Uh, we'll, we'll buy, we'll use our gift card too. Uh, we'll use, a, we'll use this one. I want to get a couple things. I d here's the thing. I think that crafting got overhauled in the reforged mod, but I still just don't really fucking care. <laughs> like, is crafting good in reforged? Chat? Is this something I'm going to feel compelled to care about? Because I'm not going to get a cracked pot if I don't think I'm going to care. 
better, but still, eh. Yeah, that butt is all I really needed. Uh, I am gonna get a bunch of these low-level smithing stands, though, for when I definitely, at some point, you know, get to, uh, the crafting and upgrade guy. I'll also get that Ash of War. Hello, donkey. Hello, donkey. Hello. <laughs> All right, let's uh, see what's in here. Rinala! I challenge you! Dude, fuck you. Yeah. No, I, I actually fell for that. I actually did not... How the fuck did I get... <laughs> what the? Huh? Tell me I climbed out of a fucking box? I didn't even know that was one that could happen. I didn't know these are part of the connections. It's dark in here. There's like a dude that's just a ball in here, man. Am I gonna blow up? Am I gonna die? Oh, he's using the spit valve. Uh, time yourself out. Whoever you are that said that. God, it's dark in this tunnel. I hope there's a light at the end of it one day. Oh my God, a light at the end of the tunnel. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Oh, that reminds me. Hang on, I'm gonna go to the bathroom in a second. Let me open this quick. Uh, I want to... I want to go in and make sure that I save a backup of this save. Because stuff can break. I want to pull that open quick. Before we do anything else. Because uh, I didn't have it set up yet. I want to just make sure that there's like a backup grabbed. Just in case. I'm just gonna pull this open quick and grab it. Okay. Okay. So it'll keep uh, like 10 minutes of backups now. Okay. I'm also gonna just grab the whole folder and move it over to my desktop. And a copy. All right, sorry about that. I wanted, to, before we got any further, I was like, I do remember seeing warnings on the fog mod to like activate the backup system. I just didn't do it. Cause you can like soft lock yourself in, in let sorry not soft lock yourself hard lock the game and like enter a crash loop occasionally dude everyone there's something in the darkness and i don't know what it is but there's something right in front of us and i can't see it but i can hear it i'm gonna turn on the flashlight a frog. <laughs> oh, there's two of them! It's his little brother! Demone! Demone frog. Okay, I'm gonna go to the bathroom now. I'm gonna leave you guys here to hang out with the frog in this fucking nasty smear of. Uh. All right, I'll be back.
know, it's just like one of those things where you're like, what were the devs thinking when they chose to make the blood these guys bleed a nasty white cum looking substance? You know what I mean? Like, like, like any, you don't have to be a rocket scientist to be like that. Dude, when that's thrown against the walls in combat and you come back there, you're going to think there's some nasty shit going on. And they're like, oh, it's lore. There's a, there's a lore reason. It's like, well, it could, you could have made it green. You could have done green or like a purple. Dude, it's fucking bioluminescent. Glows in the fucking dark. Absolutely nasty. And on a dog, but like a bad one. All right, well, uh, this is just a fucking catacomb section. Yo, let's fucking go, dude. This can't happen twice. Oh, <gasps> what? Huh? What? What the hell's going on? This is pissing me off. Activates dark form. Gets mad. Now you pissed off Bert. No, no, not Brazil. I'm getting really tired of every fog gate sending me to Brazil. And eventually, I'm gonna get mad. And I'm gonna snap. Oh, it's dark in here. Oh, fuck. Damn, one of them got inside. They're only supposed to be outside, man. What the hell? You can't be in here. Hey, bad dog. You got Oh, you gotta be kidding me. It's a scarlet rot area. I might as well give up. <laughs> I might as well give up. Go back and look for the real entrance to that catacombs. <laughs> oh, that dog's pissed immediately. Dude, then slow down. Dude, I have no way to shake the rot. Even are you? Ow. Dude, the rot is, we can't do the rot zone. The rot zone's not an option. Look at the speed it's fucking killing me. <gasps> we just gotta open the door. It, I, oh yeah, you gotta pull a lever for that. If we had full HP, maybe. Oh. Rip bozo. There's nothing bozo about that. I just didn't. I I I, la I forgot that like rot sticks to you like glue. Either way, I'm right here. I just forgot the rot like sticks to you like glue. You have to, like wash it off. Dodged. Okay, I, I was able to jump around at that time. That was good. So I can do that. That's pretty powerful. That's a compelling option. Hey guys, is there loot over here? There's nothing over here? Fuck you guys, seriously. Oh, we're good. I just have to wait here for the rot to go down. That's gonna be hard. There's a scary man with a bat. I actually took too much damage for some scary guy. I was, I, I feel like I overestimated them. My dark, bl okay. Oh, oh, that's, the, I hate those guys, dude. The mannequins, they scare me. Oh my God, it's gonna be people all day today. Get the fuck out of here. Hang on, I have some. Enhances jump attacks. I forgot I got that. My jump attacks will be even stronger now. And where the hell do I go? I, chat, here's one thing you're gonna learn about watching me play these catacomb sections. You're gonna see very quickly that I hated these zones and that's why I don't know where to go in any of them because I fucking skipped them or like actually blocked them out of my memory. 
takes off immunity amulet in Scarlet Zone. I'll give you 30 seconds to apologize for your message. I expect one. I expect that I'm sorry I said that. I expect an I'm sorry I said that. Hey, apologize. Okay. The, the nerve. Dude, I fucking hate. I feel like this is like an invisible illusory wall section. It's beneath that fucking that ledge up here. Or some bullshit. I just don't want to be up by the dog. Just gotta wait around. Dude, look at how sad this place makes fucking Bert. Look at how sad this place makes him. They hate being here. They deserve to be sad? No, they don't. Out of the way. Where is it? Oh. Where is it? Where are you hiding the- Ow. Where are you hiding the illusory wall? Dude, I don't fucking know how to progress fucking catacomb zones. Holy crap. Horrible nightmares these places are. He's not up here, there's just a hallway. I passed it. Whatever it was, I passed. These places are almost impossible without messages. I mean, I just gotta, it's, it's definitely an illusory wall then in this zone down here. I'll have to come back. You, there's a hidden wall right in front of the stone door. Okay. For the record for mods, I will, if I'm getting lost in a catacombs place, I will accept. Uh, instruction because this will be the most painful stream I've ever done if I have to fucking fumble around in these shithole nightmare zones. Don't bite me! Let me go! Okay, thank you. Give me that. Okay. Illusory wall right in front of the stone door. So it'd be either right there in the middle of that panel, in the middle of that center part. I mean, I assume it's somewhere in the, uh, that room. Because this would be stupid if it was one of these giant fucking walls. Yeah, so it's got to be like right outside this thing. So I just got to let my health come. Is it you? Fuck this place. <laughs> Dude. People call... Listen, alright. Elden Ring's a good game. Catacombs fucking suck. And this is unacceptable game design. <laughs> like, like that's unacceptable game design. It's not that bad. Yeah, but it's not good. Let's see what dark future awaits us in here. Maybe it'll be the thing that makes Bert smile. Get first edition D and D. Ah! Oh! 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 I didn't hear no bell, motherfucker. Oh, didn't even do damage, bitch. You're gonna have to try harder than that. It's too bad I'm leaving.
Yeah, last I checked, I don't gotta kill you, motherfucker. Slash B goes to the shaded castle to battle. Oh, something worse. Hang on, let me reconsider my options. A lot of HP. Yeah, right, dude. I fucking hate tree spirits. You are fucked. Uh, yeah, I can see what's happening. I can see their moves. Yeah, chat. I'm dialed in. Yeah. I was gonna say, it seems like they were having trouble hitting me. But now it seems like they figured it out. Yeah, there it is. Dude, they're just so bad. <laughs> These guys are so bad. The camera seems better somehow, despite the room. Does that make sense? I know that the Reforged mod edited the cameras of the game, and it's making it feel way more playable to fight them. Like, I can actually see what's happening a little better. Like, I can actually fight them. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. That does no fucking damage. Get greedy now. First try, dude. That's a point down, baby. Woo! Dude, I hate those guys. But the camera was definitely the problem, it feels like, because it was way easier to fight them when I could see. Well, this place is a fucking dead end, and that means I have to go fight Astle. <laughs> well, then again, that place is gonna be a dead end, too, because this whole path has been a dead end. No, um... No round table, either. Hey... When the f Did I fuck something up? Some setting, and I'm never gonna get access to the round table? I'm starting to wonder about that. Oh, hey. <laughs> Forgive me. I've been testing you to determine if the if Skip. You had, it seems torrent, whereas I Skip. Is, but I can take gathering. Skip. Take me there. Well. My hand. It's better than being here. Horse unlock. I don't even have the horse. I just can't use it. Hey guys. What the hell's this idiot? Oh, this is a rare occasion. I can't remember the last time I knew very well. As yours. <laughs> Man, dude, he put on some weight. Welcome. He changed. It is safe here. He changed, man. Allow me a house Gideon. <laughs> <of the place. laughs> Gideon. You good? Wait. But, but there's supposed to be item down there. Let's take a peek. Just a quick little peek. Aria Manor, huh? The hand zone. And the uh, giant has been moved to here so we can actually access them. That's awesome. Well, look at you. 
We don't, I presume. Shut up. Oh, I am an old codger. So here, yeah, perhaps. Please take oh, care. Oh, I'm that's just his conversation. Yeah, we don't talk to people in mod games. What do you sell? I still, this dude, dude, you can't just sell death root. That's illegal, man. You can't sell that. Man, that's illegal. You actually can't sell that. I have to call the police. Also, you shouldn't be selling some old man's full head. Well, at least I can technically upgrade uh, items here. I mean, the other blacksmith definitely still exists, so. Uh... Do I need gloves? I think I do need gloves. I should probably go back there and get gloves. Yeah, I do need gloves. Hello. I don't believe we've met. I'm known as D. I hunt down those who Just such a bad name. Heed my warning. Those who live in death D. should be left all the more unless you will. Okay, dude. If you, if you give me more. items, that's all I really care those about. I don't remember who more. gives items. Oh, I see you've just arrived. Hello. Welcome to the right I should explore this so that one day ensuring by the way. Yeah, I see it. Whatever it is you're asking me, I do. Here, I've got a bunch of prayer books. It's Take it. Very well. And this one. Is a work of heresy. It's income. Take it. Now it looks like I can learn uh, quite a few faiths now, so it might be worth doing a faith build, chat. <clears throat> chat, it might be worth doing a faith build. We have access. To many horrid faith moves. May the golden order shine through. Yeah, shut up. Can't go in that way. Hang on. Ah, I'm well. The honor of one. By the way. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Sure. I'm just che I'm just checking because I can't remember if guys are, if anyone's like oh and I also have like two dollars and that two dollars could be a legendary sword in this version. Always gotta check. Hey. Greetings, great champion called I am circum. Great chaps, you might doing so. And you, do you think it vulgar? Perhaps where I come. No, no, no amount of holding Bert could make them happy. Okay, no amount. I your disdain is. No amount. Nothing could make Bert happy. But item. The hug does give an item in rando. Aw, oh, fuck. But they're gonna... It's gonna hurt me. They're gonna take away, like, five of my health. Greeting. I am <sighs> circumstant. Perhaps you doing so. <laughs> Fine. But I'm not gonna be smiling. I'm not going to be smiling. You are very warm. Yeah, but not a single smile on that face. What you felt like oh, it is That's not a random blessing. Thing. That's not a random item. That's the thing I was supposed to get. Ban whoever said that for life. Ban them. Now I'm sick. Would you like the blessing? Would you like? You did this to me. Now I got this stink on me. Wait, what? Santa? Tarnished, and I can also that you're not up there. Why I am Carl. So this guy sells us uh, like the locations of items, which, in the context of the fog gate randomizer, is like selling me garbage that says the legendary item is somewhere in like New York. Like, it, like, okay, like, it's in New York. Uh, it doesn't even dictate, like, the state or the city. It just says New York. Uh, and I just kind of, I, I know it's there, but I don't know how to get there. Let's see what they sell. Serpent Bone Blade. 
and ivory sickle and shard of alexander greatly boosts the attack power of skills why do you have this why do you have that you know what i mean man you better tell me right now why you have that shard what'd you do to my boy what did you do to my best friend? Oh, I should buy one of these. And by one of these, I do mean literally one of these. I mean, I'm gonna... Probably gonna get the shard. Because it is gonna... It's a good up... It's a good item. So I'm gonna use a... I'm gonna use a gift card on that. Yeah, what is this crap? I don't want an item crap to my inventory. Yeah, we're gonna use a gift card. Where the hell is my... Okay. I need five things. Yeah, I'm gonna get the... I'm gonna get the Alexander thing quick. What is it? Goodbye. Thank you. Alexander would have wanted me to have it, not you. Now, I can't open any of these doors, but that does take me somewhere. This is another fog gate. Oh, wait, no, this is just the fucking stone thing. But I do think some of those stone things that you open actually do fog gate people, so that some of them, some of them that don't really have much in them could still fog gate me somewhere. I don't really know. Yeah, that place is a dead end. Let's check the other side, and then I might upgrade the log sword a little, because it's really all I have right now, and need a weapon to do damage. Hello. Dude. You look like a fucking- you look like an actual cock. Like, you should be saying something to me. Like, there, like you need to explain your outfit, or something. You look like an actual penis. If I was squinting and I came right in, I'd actually be a little fucking stunt. So say something. He's nothing to see. Uh, what do you need? <laughs> Gideon, what the fuck happened to you? Then you would do what? Stand beneath those words. Follow the guide and do so. Dude, he looks all nasty. Dude. He's got that hunch, and he's got that gut. Why do you keep bullying him? Cause look at him. That's not the Gideon I know. What do you sell? Yo, some good stuff in here. Okay. Uh, all right. Okay. Okay. Some pots? So they sell... You sell them that for one dollar. You're gonna sell- you're gonna sell that for one dollar. Parrying dagger. I might take the parrying dagger too. I mean, this is what gift cards are for, right? So I can just fucking grab 10k and buy a bunch of shit I want real quick. So like that's an urgent must have. Uh let's see. Get that. Get that too. I don't really care too much about the big I'm just buying them like just maybe just in case. We need to get our decks up enough to use the parrying dagger. Or do we need to if we're just parrying with it? I don't think we need to if we're just using it to parry. I should buy one of these. Okay. Hey! What's up? Have you ever felt the curse? Somehow the still managed to get a nasty hat on despite it all. Life itself. Feared and despised by all. <sighs> Apparently not. 
You all but allow you no longer Despite everything, me. he managed to get the oh, nasty hat. Uh, just a slightly different one. That makes Bert sad. <laughs> that just makes Bert so fucking sad. Well, guess it's time to get the hell out of here after I activate my fucking uh, stone sword key. You know, Chad, I've realized something that's kind of unacceptable in this video game. And it's that my character really does just knock everything over and make a complete ass of himself 24-7 while he walks around. Like, I walk by stacks of clearly intended stacked up, like, books, and he just knocks it all over and doesn't apologize or anything. He just does it. Fight the downstairs, man. That was a good message. You're right. I probably should. If I could get there. Okay, so that was like an investment that went really bad. Okay, so how much was that stone sword key? Was that like three or four thousand souls? And that was a two hundred return? Dude. <laughs> I bought a fucking scratch card and I lost really bad. But it, I couldn't, dude, I, okay, now I have to use the other gift card and hyper invest into the other one. Because if I don't, I'm, I have to use the big one. We're gonna buy the rest of the stuff that I want from the store, we're gonna use the big one. I now I have to fucking open the other thing, or I'm fucked, okay? We, we've sunk, the cost has been sunk, we need to get in and get something. We're going in. Oh wait, I have a bell bearing. That might not actually, uh... Oh no, it really does. Okay, that's good. I really, I totally forgot bell bearings were a mechanic. Okay, uh... Okay, I'm just gonna buy two, I'm gonna buy one more. I'll buy two more, we're gonna end up using them. Uh, I'm also gonna buy one... That's a plus, that's plus two. I mean... I That's a really good talisman. And unless I'm you unless I'm fighting stuff for robustness, immunity, or concentration, I think I just want this on to protect me from every element. Yeah. Anyways. Oh, I those I actually can't knock over. Is there anything here I can knock over? I want to do an Ashes of War thing. I want to put holy... I want to bless my inverted hawk shield. Thank you. And I also want to use... Listen, chat. No, I'm not going to do that, but... Let it be known that the Glintstone Pebble... Actually... Probably... It's, no, 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 but the problem is... The problem is... The longsword's default move of the dark blade is so iconic, I can't use it. I can't, I can't like use glintstone pebble. I have to like the 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 dark, the dark blade is iconic. Well, we invested eight thousand dollars into this and. 4,000 the last one, so this chest better spit out a 12,000 value item. <laughs> Why does it have to be a, like, obvious transaction I've just lost twice? Why couldn't it be like a fucking talisman? Fuck! That minus 5,000? Uh, no, minus 9,000. Thank you very much. I'd appreciate you remembering that as we move forward. Fuck!
Okay, man. Well, uh, we don't have any faith yet to do anything with that. We do have a parrying dagger, and I think we can parry even without dex. Slash me, change. Wait, resurrect bosses? Oh, I could kick someone's ass again. Well. Uh, I can start putting a little bit in it. No, well, we need. We really need to just keep putting in the strength and dex for a little bit longer. We're gonna find a weapon that's good soon. That I want to use. So what the fuck was I doing? Did I want to go? Hang on. So like, here's the thing. Where the fuck? Okay, so Castellan's Hall is how I get back to Astal. I want to see if I want to see how the scaling's looking on Astal right now. All right, let's just. Astal! I've returned more powerful than ever. Your time is now. Darth Burt arises. Dodge! You're gonna have to try harder than that if you want to defeat me. Oh, fuck. If you want to defeat me, you're gonna have to... You know, I was really good at your boss fight, Astle. I was actually really good at your boss fight, Astle. No, I was- I actually considered myself a gamer. I don't remember that move. Oh, that's his teleport move. Cool move, dude. Arena's a little small for it. At least in the way you went. That's a good hitbox. <laughs> I just wanted to give some respect to the devs on that one. That's a good hitbox. We gotta respect the hustle. When the armpit, that's like some Monster Hunter Rathalos hitbox right there, you know? I mean, the scaling's been pretty good in that, like, there's no enemies I've bumped into so far that I don't feel like I can beat. Like, I can kill Ask. He's gonna beat me probably this time, but I can kill him. Ow! He did the... He bit me! <laughs> Dude, what even- who are you even aiming at sometimes, man? I, sometimes I just don't know where you're aiming, Astle. Oh, whoa, 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 wait. I just realized now that that fight was so loud. I'm turning the game down. Ha! You know, I have spawn protection, Astle. You do best to remember that going forward. Vertical swing on that move. Dude, I'm just waiting for him to glitch himself out of the map and die. Like, by accident, just fall out of the map. Ow, ow. Damn, that move hits. Wait. No. I'm too slow. Ow. I'm too slow to dodge that. Good news is most of his attacks miss. So that's the trick with Astral is most of his moves, well, they miss. He's just got a really bad aim. His only damaging move that hits all the time is the armpit. His loathsome armpit move.
you sure do a good job at getting hit by it. I think Astel is the biggest offender of boss too big in uh, Elden Ring, aside from the fire giant. God forbid we ever run into them. Uh, in that their armpit hits me. Uh, and I don't know what part of Astel's armpit is the damaging part, but damn it! He waited just through my fucking spawn protection and hit me at his full power. That won't happen again, Astel. You're lucky I have a short weapon. You're lucky I'm short and I have a short weapon and can't reach good. You're lucky I'm small and you're big. Just go ahead, keep punching down, Astle, you jerk. Thing is, this dude's an optional boss. I don't even have to fight him. He just teleports to the same spot. Oh. Whoa, hey, whoa, 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 ow. Did he just almost, did I, was I standing on him? Well, I wanted to see how Astol's uh, scaling was, but I don't think I actually have to fight him for any reason, so we're gonna grace last visited and go back to Firelink, or whatever the fuck it is in this game, and go through the big gate there. We'll come back to that. But honestly, of the bosses I'm down to fight, I uh, I don't really feel like spending a bunch of time on Astel if they're not required. If they're not clearly giving me an option to go somewhere. All right. Which means next is uh, Hand Manor. which will likely be pretty sparse on hands. On account of the randomizer. Wait, could I have summoned Torrent for a minute out here? Yo, we got the horse for a second. Damn, that's a big fog wall. Well, we got to ride around on your horse for a second. for just a second. Well, I hope you all had fun with that too, cause, well, wait, what if we can, what if there's more over here and it's like there's actually an option to like explore? Wait, it's not turning. Oh. Every low angle of Bertram here is like the funniest shit to me. I don't know. It's the low angles. The dreaded low angle Bertram shot. I think, hang on. I actually remembered uh, every map of every place of interest in the entire game is l like labeled. So there is nothing over here. I was like, for some reason I was just checking to see if there's- Ooh, there's an item! Two hundred dollars! Well, now I'm only down eight thousand eight hundred dollars! That's something. That's- Now that's- That's just- That's- Stuff's starting to look up. And Torrent dies when we do that. It's kind of like the Star Trek teleporter logic. It's kind of like a Star Trek teleporter situation. Their atoms are torn to shreds. Dude, why is, can't I have like a fucking tick box when I start the game that says, is my character, like any RPG. Should have the setting that I can tick that says my character would not collect shit off of an enemy's corpse. Like, they would not pick up weird colored shit and put it in their bag. Like, cause like, that's like a, like, I don't, like, it's an RPG. Let me decide for myself. This character would not pick up 
actual feces out of an enemy's pocket. No, Bertram wouldn't. They're my character. You don't get to decide that. You don't get to say. Wait, wait, they get to bring mounts in? Wait a minute. Hey, that's not fair. I don't get to bring mounts in. Ow! 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 Dude, who even are you? Fuck off. This is between me and Ant person, okay? Who the hell was that? Some dude just started, like, screaming. I'm going back there. Dude, stop picking shit up off of that guy. But we did get an Academy Glintstone staff that time. Oh, it's a nasty boy. He dropped a rune arc in $2,000. Nice. <laughs> nice. Are you sure you want this fight? Are you sure you wish to face off against... Ow! 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 Dude, madness in this game is scary. <laughs> that dude has better scaling than the bosses. <laughs> I don't know why I keep killing that guy. He just keeps dropping shit. Like, it's like every time. There's one constant in this world, and it's that that guy will drop gold-colored shit. There's gonna be a lot of enemies. This place might actually be, like, kind of a shithole. Because, like, there's gonna be a lot of enemies. Damn, this guy's got health, too. It's okay, man. Relax. Your moves are cringe, man. But I will take that gravity stone fan and use it on that guy to teach him a lesson. Prepare yourself. Okay, that actually did really good damage. You should have never fixed off against me. What were you thinking? Chet, remember, don't let any of this stuff distract you from the reality that my character knows Kung Fu. Okay, don't ever forget that. I just choose not to use it because it would make it too easy. Faster than walking. <laughs> Don't point that out. That's gonna ruin the entire fucking mod pack. Who just shot me in the ass? And then in the chat. Okay, it's this asshole. Dude, these bow guys are actually really bad news because they do that point blank machine gun blast. I hate them. Look at that, he was trying it. Whoa, dude, a normal dagger. Do you think the dagger gets the treatment? I might not have time to check. They're using their bubble moves on me. Dude. Cool move. Am I gonna die? They did the bubble move on me, and now I got a giant bubble on me? Chat, I don't feel so good. Dude, that guy dropped a lot of shit. 
every enemy, it feels like Arcane's kind of a pretty spicy thing to level in this mod. Because all the enemies are dropping like good stuff. But we're gonna keep bum, we're gonna keep bum rushing faith. Thing is, I am gonna check right now. I want to see if the dagger art has been changed, like the longsword. What? Hold armament in a brief silent prayer to create a white shadow. The apparition lures in foes of human build who are not in combat, drawing their aggression. Okay, well, I mean, it's no, uh, it's no square off. And by square off, of course, I mean the dark blade. This place is a fucking mess. That was easy. Okay, no one reacted to that. I'm just gonna keep escalating. I think there's an angry frog and that's about it. Yeah, there's just my OC if I was in Elden Ring for real. There's just- Oh! Okay. Uh... I actually really don't like fighting those weird guys. Yeah, no, that guy sucks so bad. I'm gonna go now. Yeah, I don't want any trouble. I'm leaving. I left. Gravity Stone Fan Attack! Again! Ow! <laughs> What is up with the geometry of this pillar? Yeah. He doesn't know. He actually doesn't know. Dude, it is not healthy to have an eye blow up move, man. That's just like... You need to go to a doctor. You fought well! But- Oh, the tree killed me. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Alright, you fought well and you won. Oh, uh, cause that, that tree fucking body blocked me hard. <laughs> I got stuck on the tree, I missed my stab. Oh, fuck. Well, look, I've been killing these enemies because they've been dropping good stuff, but I don't need to kill them to progress, so we're probably just gonna move on and explore and pick up items off the ground that'll actually be good. Like this dress. Oh my god. Damn, bird! What the fuck? Damn! That frog didn't even know what to do. They just started staring. And they dropped their grease and the Damn. I do not like the blood. I do not like <laughs> I do not like their nasty blood. I do not like it at all. Hello. Ow! Owie! Ouch! Ouch! Ow! Ouch! Ow! Ow! Okay. Do I get any buffs for wearing this, or is this just kind of for me? Slowly replenishes HP of nearby allies, but not that of the wearer. <laughs> yeah, I don't got any of those, though. I don't have one of those. Crab. Crab, why are you so desperate to have me kill you? I forgot about the sleep move the crab has. I also don't really know why it didn't knock me out. I 
think I took a small hit. Dude, I fucking hate the crabs. I hate the crab as much as I hate the lobster. Dude, who the fuck are you? You're like the weirdest fucker in the game. You're just some naked, undead guy with a bow. You don't even have clothes. You're literally naked. That's it. I'm slamming you with the fucking martial arts roundhouse kick death slam. Get ready, here I go. Get ready, here I go. That was an example of what's the call. Oh! Get the fuck out of here, points down. Owie! Ouch! 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 Owie! Ow, 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 ow. Ouch. That one's gonna sting. Yeah, I'm gonna feel that one later. Damn. Back to it. There was an item back there. I'm gonna get it. I don't care if it puts me in mortal danger or not. His back is so bad. <laughs> it looks like another frowning face, dude. You look at it. You can see the fucking frown. There's a frown on his back. Give me a good item. Did that all for some leaves. Cool, dude. And now I'm getting fully body blocked by the crab. That hurt you more than it hurt me. You sure you want this fight, Crab Chan? Dude, I got distracted by the fucking Sasquatch I saw and I thought I saw. I didn't even think that was a giant. I was like, that's a fucking, that's a Yeti. Like, I saw a Yeti and I forgot there was, like, snow versions of giants in the game and I just got I actually just froze up. I think I need to put my- chat, the dress is good, but that's when I want to really disrespect someone. I gotta get back into my battle dress, you know? That actually provides me with armor and protection. Oh my god, it's a normal creature that would have spawned in this place. And then a bunch of weirdos. <laughs> it's one normal guy, and then a lot of weirdos. And like, creeps. Okay, this guy has to fucking die already. Oh! Dude, garbage. Thanks. Damn, man. Looking good. Looking good in your pajamas, man. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. <laughs> Looking good, Bert. Looking good, Bert. Damn, Bert. What happened to you? <laughs> Look, dressed up like a princess. Damn, Bert. Hell yeah. Medieval cat girl. Look. Chat, let Bert do whatever they want. They've had such a hard life. <laughs> Chat, Bert's had such a hard life. Let them do what they want. Is that the accursed staff? Is that a... It, it has faith scaling, but requires no faith. Okay, dude, I'm in the fucking inventory thing, you freak.
What the? Thanks? Pretty cool item. Not bad. Bah! Yeah, I mean, that's pretty epic, but like, you know, so is like this dagger that makes you send out like funny mist, you know? Bah! Yeah, that's cool too. And I want to be fair to all the items. So let's also. I thought this staff would be a lot smaller. Chat, we gotta use the spiky gloves, right? Like. <sighs> but then we'll be losing out on. Then we won't be able to use the faith bill. I mean, they're better damage already than the sword is. Like, they're better. It's better than the than the sword. Well, it's not really, but only by a little. And I mean, I can still have. I can still be. Look, this thing's got good enough scaling and everything that I mean, I can just like not do that much arcane. I could just not do that much of the arcane part and be fine on damage still. You know. I think we go with it for now, because it's the first, like, really cool weapon we've gotten. Let's test it on this guy. Give me a fucking break. Are you kidding me? I'm using these forever. What, are you kidding me? Did you see that? Did you see what I did to them? They exploded. What's up? You sure? You sure? You guys fucking sure? You sure this is the- oh! Dude, I guess we're strength punch build. This is just some guy. Wait, what? This is just some guy. That frown with the hood makes you look like a weird Judge Dredd. <laughs> Damn, true. Do I really want to even chance getting that item? I will with a full health pot. Let's fucking go. Some kind of seal. I mean, the souls matter not to me. It's not about the souls. It's about the kills. Punched. Leave me alone, you freaks. Leave me, leave me alone. I don't want any trouble. Consider that a warning! I the lava- the lava surfing is interesting, but I don't think it's the best part of the build. But it is interesting. But I don't think it's the best part. Can I like... What if I hold it? Okay, I changed my mind. This is the best thing in the game. <laughs> okay, Chad, I changed my mind. This guy's got the I just got the best weapon in the whole game. Uh Quite literally nothing could beat this. Yeah. <laughs> the guy's just like a Dragon Ball Z character. <laughs> He's just like a fucking freak now. This dog's still gonna fucking kill me. I better get out of here. 
It's the stuff's looking bad. I gotta get out of here. Closest thing I'm gonna get to a horse inside the fucking dungeon. Well, it's cool that I can do that. I'm gonna go rest at the campfire quick. Fuck, man, that's so cool. I, I don't remember this item. There's a lot of items I didn't like pick up and check out in the original game. But like, this one's cool enough that I feel like it's modded. <laughs> this one, is this mod, is this partially modded? This item? Lava surfing is not base game. Okay, cause I'm like, I feel like I would have seen clips of the lava surfing move. That's so cool. That's a really cool mod ability, dude. That's really cool. That is a grade A item we pulled out of that enemy. See, I really like this randomizer setup is really good in that like most of the enemies are dropping cool things from their loot table too. So we're like, what's up? Oh, that's cool. Okay, gonna whip me from a distance. Don't make me come over there. Activate surf move. You guys mind if I point down real quick? Oh, sorry. How rude of me. Now I'll do it. Dude, I think I got a pump FP. <laughs> I think we need to raise our mind more. Cause how else I need I need these points to surf. Without FP, I ow. Dude, like the thing is, look at how quickly it breaks stagger. Like you in I'm instantly in a combo staggering people. Hang on, I'm just gonna fucking own this guy quick. I'm just gonna send this guy to the shadow round. He knew! <laughs> okay. Is it too, it has bleed. It doesn't need bleed. This weapon doesn't need bleed. I narrow my eyes a little bit at the bleed. Cause I don't, I don't really think it needs bleed on top. Oh. A place of grace, a place to rest my weary head. Dude, I like this hat, but uh, I do like this one more cause it shows my face better. That, that move you're using is crazy. You gotta get rid of the weapon, dude. It's gonna break the game. It's gonna be fine. The scaling is gonna be fine. What is this? Oh. Leaf dumpling. That said, if this ends up being too powerful, I will just switch off of it. Because there's a lot of other weapons and a lot of stuff's changed and I don't want to pigeonhole myself into one thing. Hey, man. This place a lot more complicated than I remember. But at the end of the day, uh, you a real slow guy. And my guy punches really fast. So he's gone. Okay. I don't like this area. There's no items here. I'm just gonna run by these guys. 
There's no items here. It's just like a fucking waste of time. There's just little crabs and like dogs. I'm gonna save my surf for when I need it to get by someone. Urgent. I needed it! I needed it right there! Oh! Oh, there's an item over there. I should go get that. Dude, I'm pretty sure my dash coats the entire fucking pathway in lava. Excuse me. Dude, my dash is the fucking slam. Ain't no way. Ain't no. Ain't no way that's my fucking dash move. Anytime I dash into someone, I stagger them instantly. Essentially. Slam build. Unless it's like that guy who's way stronger. Ball. I'm gonna take the elevator and go. Don't follow me. Okay. Not much longer now. And then we'll get to the top, and then we'll, I mean, maybe that'll be a boss fight. Maybe we'll actually get set to a boss fight. Finger Maiden shoes. That'll go well with my dress. Damn, Bert, what the fuck? <laughs> Hello, doggy. A little overkill. It's so strong. <laughs> ah, to be back in the simple times of using a long sword with the dark power of a curse on it. And now my character just ch chews up anything he touches. I got gauntlets! Just... Normal gloves. That's cool. I was worried I'd never find gloves. Whoa. There's a lot of guys here. I'm not so sure I can handle these. <laughs> It canceled my animation. Hang on, one check. Where are they? Oh. Damn, this fucking octopus needs to chill, man. The octopus enemy needs to chill. What was that? He was like, the, uh, the octopus can basically fly. They fly. I can't fly. Why can't I do that? Why is my weapon more powerful? How is it that I can be defeated by a big old pile of spaghetti? Where's the balance? Dude, relax. Oh! He's back! Honestly, the weakest part of the weapon, which might balance it a little bit, is the opener. The opener takes a long time. Dude! Dude! 
You're just a, like a, you're just like a big ball. Relax. Oh wait, hang on, I'm ripping him up. Oh, hang on. <laughs> the tide changed. Uh, the instant I stopped, uh, panicking. Okay. Yep. Back up the hill. Still some items around, and then it's the fog gate. Yeah. Gelmir Night Armor. Damn. I mean, I hate this look. I prefer Melania's armor. How many bosses have you beaten so far? I don't know. Time's like blending together when I'm playing this mod pack because everything's. Everything is both like. Oh, it's a door! The last hand! Oh, it fell. Dude, I'm not fighting that thing. I hate those guys. Dude, is that a little free? Is that one of the nasty boys? Hell yeah. Ash of War. Can't remember if there's anything else. There was like that drop down in the earlier zone that I can like do to access some other stuff. Get to like that merchant. I kind of want to do that. Well, good news is the hand doesn't know how to get to me. Dude. Fucking goodbye. Oh, gloves. It's like if you don't have poise, you just get instantly guaranteed on a parry. It's fucked. Okay, well, uh. I do see item down there, but me have souls on me. Me not know if me wanna, <laughs> if me wanna risk it like this. <laughs> That's just a door. <laughs> well, well, well. If it isn't my great nemesis, who the fuck are all these guys? Who the fuck are all you guys? Who are all you guys come from? I gotta get out of here. Dude, there's a lot of guys on this fucking place. I lived. Didn't see that one coming, did you, you goons? Oh, I gotta get out of here. There's still too many of them. Why am I fighting you? You're nobody. I'm getting close to the drop down. I feel like I missed an item or two, but... I also don't want to die. Is there anything over here? There's also that jump. Don't be rude. The guy, I'm, I'm being honest. I'm gonna grab what's on this. Aspects of the Crucible Horns. What the fuck is that? Huh? Hmm. 
Wah. Creates shoulder horn to gore foes from low stance. That would fit my new wrestler build I'm going for. Yeah, I'm kind of going for like a super powerful wrestler build. All right, let's go back up. And also level up. Shall I, turn I don't remember which one of these ways takes me to the, uh... Your thoughts, your ambitions, okay, so right now... The no one gives a fuck about follow. decks. What? Hmm, now that's some, uh... Now that's some real classic scale. Now, what did this did these gloves not say they were uh arcane B scaling? I'm just not seeing a lot of movement on the numbers when I bring arcane up for the bleed. Oh, the bleed is OP. I'm not going to uh, we don't need to buff it. We don't need to buff the weapon's bleed. It shouldn't even have bleed. Uh so I I think I might start pumping the faith like I was going to do. I do want to have faith abilities. We have a lot of- we've been given enough faith stuff now that I want to do faith. All right? Faith, mind, strength. Leave me alone. We definitely don't need to buff the blood. I gotta get by these guys, and I gotta get by them fast! Okay. Okay, the dash, the lava surfing is balanced by the fact that I suck at it. I gotta get by this guy, and I gotta get by him fast! Who's behind the door? What's behind the door? Oh, catacombs. I'm so happy. Is is Bertram's neck getting wrinklier and veinier? I'm so happy. My catacombs. Where's the drop down for that shop, Chad? I don't remember where it is. I kind of want to go back and do that. The guy who's like in that like tower. Was it here and I missed it? Or was it be- It's beyond the fog wall? Oh, okay then. I- That's what I thought. I couldn't remember if I had to do something earlier. Yeah, then we're not gonna be able to do that yet. There's no telling when we'll be able to access Loretta's boss fight. Could be a thousand years from now because that's connected to another zone of the game and not the place it was originally. I'd like to let my hand share them. Why am I even talking to you? I have nothing to say to you. Get out of my way. Wait, what zone is this in? Altus Plateau? Because that tells me how obnoxious the place is going to be. And wow, that's a trap already. Good. 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 God, I fucking hate these places. Guillotines. Don't you fucking try it. Do you think I'm an idiot? I'm not gonna let that guy do his madness nightmare strike on me again. Dude. <laughs> what are you doing? Who's that for? It was a nice try, but it's gonna take a lot more than that to defeat the- What the fuck is this place? What the fuck is this? What is this? Got a dash! Ow. 
Can't believe that shit worked. What the fuck? Damn, I'm good. What the shit? I'm sorry, are you fucking telling me that this in one-handed mode lets me fucking earthbend? Dude. What the fuck is this weapon? Yeah, dude, I wanted to make a pretty cool weapon for Elden Ring, so I made the strongest, coolest weapon in the entire fucking game as a mod. What's up? You wanna? No, 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 no! Oh! Oh! Huh? Oh, it's an ultimate frisbee player. I should have fucking known by how fucking. God damn it! God damn it! It's another one of the fucking ultimate frisbee players we were running into. They're everywhere! Tomato found the debug weapon. Let's ask this about the lore. It literally calls itself earthbending. Spherical iron manifer covered in spikes, which induces blood loss. Okay, so they didn't really want to give it a real backstory to explain how I can lava surf, but I can. Oh, good. This is one of those catacombs. Chat. Is it a controversial take to say this could have been two stories of stairs and then just gotten me to where I wanted to go instead of me having to wait for the L? There's too many elevators in Elden Ring. That is my hot take for the day. There's too many elevators. What the fuck is the point of them? I don't understand. Why the heck in heck did it matter? I'm gonna have to surf back through the spooky place. He hates accessibility. It's just there's so fucking many. Oh no, he's doing his brain blast move. No! That guy's the strongest enemy in the game. It's him. It's him. He's it. That guy's the strongest guy. No one else has mattered. That dude brain blasts me every time I go by him. Just murdered the avatar like it was nothing. Yeah, I would describe Bert as likely the next avatar. That is about right. I wanted to see if there was like a thing up there. There isn't. Don't use your. Don't do it. Not gonna fucking let ya. Where's that other guy? Did he just get killed by the guillotine? I think he just got killed by the guillotine. <laughs> what is this weapon? The fucking rocks bleed? Oh, guys, new hot weapon just dropped. We got the weathered straight sword. It also has square off, but is it really square off? It's been some time since I've embraced the darkness. Dude, why do you have it then? I was literally gonna let him hit me for a bit. Why do you, why do you have it put there then? Did I walk too fast? Did I walk too fast? Oh, oops, I didn't want to drink that. See ya. I 
fucked up the timing. I'm dead. There's no way I get up now. Doggy, please! This room is cursed. Okay, so essentially I have to get far enough in that I can do the slide. Because that's the only thing that slows everything down long enough for me to get up the ladder to leave. So I have to get deep enough into that room. Or I have to clear some of it. The problem's the dog. The dog's gotta go. Maybe we earthbend from a distance and kite them one by one. I think that might also be an option. We do a, we do a longer range earthbend kite. Dude, it's just... I mean, we could easily kite them with this. No, no, no! Yeah, I mean, I could try it. What's the heavy move? I'm sorry. Did my guy just throw a rock from over there? Hang on. I send a rock up from about a mile away. Is there a, a sequel to that move? Bro. <laughs> I can just... Hang on, let me just... 56 or 59. It doesn't do more damage. Or anything. But it's not like it needs to. Dude, use it. Let's not forget that the stone stack on top of the punch, which also does damage. Yeah, I think it's worth clearing some of them like this. Dude, it's... I mean, like, what, what? what's there to say? You know, like, I can fixate all day on how strong it is. I'm still using it. I'm still gonna use it. I'm still gonna activate my fucking bending, man. I'm still gonna do the spin. The dog is still gonna win the fight. Because it's the dog from Kaled, and dog always from Kaled win. Yes. See, the dog is the strongest enemy in the whole game. Oh, wait. Hang on. I got him. Turns out I could just attack them. <laughs> Rock slide! Wait. <laughs> Whoa! What the? What is this? There's just, there's more moves. So the jump move is a roundhouse that makes me spin. If I heavy attack, I do this like spin back and then I, it just keeps getting better. It's just a, it's just a super God move. <laughs> well, why would you use anything else? What's good? He won! That guy's the strongest character in the game. He bled me while I was bleeding him. That guy's stronger than me. That guy, he took me down. Damn, foiled again. I mean, if I just kill the dog, I can run by everyone else. 
So I'm just gonna try to clear out that dog again and then get the fuck out of this shithole. It looks like a lot of fun to use though. Oh yeah, no. This is the most fun weapon I've ever held in a like Souls game in my entire life. Like this is some of the dumbest fun I've ever had using a weapon. Well, we did just get the curved club chat, so we do have to give it a check. We have no idea what kind of... Okay, it's just got the yell, but it does light the curved club on fire. Which is cool, I guess. If that's like what you're into. It's no punch glove, though. <laughs> Hello. So like the two-handed is for like AOE fighting. One-handed is for single target. Hang on one second. Let's get to clear some ads from fuck. Dude, there's no fall off on the distance of the attack. Which uh, today I learned. <laughs> today I learned there's actually no fall off. It can go forever. Damn. Well, I guess I'll use it to clear everything from a mile away and finish this fucking nightmare. Wait, are you kidding me? Are you? Did you choose a ranged attack on me? On Bert? This guy might not bleed. You have blood, man? Oh. It's the protagonist. Ow. I am just gonna do that. Oh no, it's him. It's the Sanguine Noble. Let me leave! I didn't mean no harm, man! Oh, fuck! Ah! Oh, get the fuck away from me! That's a big sword he threw into my chest, and that was the last of my healing, again. Dude, this place sucks. <gasps> Easy, you freak! Don't know what to do! <laughs> Gravity Stone Fan, go! I... Throw a rock at him? Just doesn't... I can try this one. Problem is, the lock-on makes it harder. If I don't lock-on, it just goes straight up in the air. I need the dog to lose interest in me long enough for me to get a shot off. Okay. I wish I could heal. Yeah, I'm not going anywhere near these guys. I have no healing. There's a scary frog man over there who probably one shot. Oh! Who? Who and from where? Oh, there's a trap on the ground. There's a trap. There's a, a fucking plate trap on the ground. Oh good. The elevator is not up here. That makes Bert sad. Owned by a Minecraft pressure plate. Dude, you know, I did know when I got into this stream 
that the worst zones that would be the hardest and largest struggle to progress through would be catacombs because they are fucked. And I don't think anyone from FromSoft played any of them. They just kind of let them exist. And like, yeah, it's randomized. There's a lot of bad stuff in here that shouldn't be in there, but the place is also just miserable. <laughs> It's funny how, e like, getting this incredibly strong weapon, I was immediately humbled by just the most insane seed of enemies in a room ever. It's kind of... It's kind of interesting. Hang on, I got given a new weapon. Matter of fact, I got given two of them. Yeah, man. What is that, the classic? What is that, a normal stomp? Boring, dude! I have gloves that let me surf and explode the map at will! Why would I care, dude? Explain to me! Okay, that'll clear some ads. We need to do that again before the dog gets back! Doggy, no! Okay, dog's gone. That means I can leave. Here I go. I'm gonna fuck off. See you later, idiot. Yeah, no interest in that this time. <gasps> Climb, man! Alright, good. So what the fuck killed me? Last time I went up here. I don't remember anymore. It's been a bit. What the fuck killed me? Oh, yeah. I died because of a goof. I watched a fucking frog throw a frisbee at me. It wasn't even... It wasn't even real. Oh, I don't have a thing for that. It wasn't a real loss. Your turn. What? Why is it when I do it, it crushes me, and when he does it, he gets a nice ride back to the bottom? Dude. No! Not poison! I have no way to cure it! This guy's the strongest character- Alright, I'm not gonna fuck around. Okay, that's a guy with a lot of HP. He yelled at me! Oh. Not fair, dude. You're clipping out of the map. I can't see what moves you're doing, man. Ha! <laughs> he hit the fucking ceiling! Idiot. We hit the lever. All right, we got it. We can fucking leave. <laughs> we can, we can leave, Jet. Is there a door down there? I want to go to that door down there. Actually, I guess up here is where I came from. I think I just teleport back now. Yeah, I got the lever. Let's go back. I'm not going back all the way through all that shit. I don't care about what was behind that fucking door. The, the, like the gray door. I just don't care. It can't be anything better than these gloves. Dude, it just can't be. So fuck it. And now, I have souls. Hang on one second. Changing my, changing the plan. And now to claim some of my gift cards and level up a little. I would like to pump my faith and my strength. Shall I let my share them with me? Dude, you know what? I'm gonna say something a little fucking mean. Um, I prefer my FromSoft games 
where I don't have to fucking talk to someone for two lines of repetitive dialogue in order to level. That's modded in SMH? I know. And I appreciated it when they stayed gone. Where's this taking me? Hey, what? Where are we... Where are we going? <laughs> Damn, we're like right there! Fuck! Dude, jump the fence! <laughs> Dude, just jump it. Jump the fence. Oh, hey. Fuck, man. We were, we were right there. What's up? You're going to come with me. We're going to have many battles together. Cool. A jar. Yeah, I can actually see the next fog gate. It's like two inches away. Melania, help me. Help me. Oh my god. Kill him. Slay him. Oh, fuck. He made him kill- He killed himself! That was a tanky boy. God, I just can't walk places anymore, you know? Dude, I gotta get that ability- I gotta get that fucking wondrous flask thing that gives me, uh... The infinite fucking, like, uh, FP. I also need to get a wondrous flask. But when I get those two things, dude, we will be cooking with gas. I know I need to go down. There's... <laughs> nah, I'm not going down there, though. No, though. I mean, technically we could, you know, we could fight him. Is that the real one? Which one do you think that is? Let's uh, let's check this first. I got a lot of, I got a lot of soul. Oh fuck. <laughs> you can't go this way, Melina. We need to go a different way. Hang on. I really, I really want, what are you doing? Yo, Molino, yeah, hit him with the- hit him with some magic. Get down there and fucking kill that guy. <laughs> Go on. Go on, get him from here. Hit him with something over the ledge. Yeah. I have 12,000 souls. I need to use them before I go do stuff anymore. It's, my level ups are getting a little expensive to be like... Fucking, like, just tossing my body into pits where a boss could own me a couple times. So I'm gonna quickly just rest. I'll resummon Melina because it's fucking funny. And then I might jump down there. You can literally do earthbending. Yeah, but my earthbending makes me step forward a little bit when I do it. And uh You know, I don't really want to get like oh fuck. As long as you're here, I have to like rem uh, I'm gonna have to desummon you. Sorry, idiot. Yeah, I gotta evict you. Sorry, Melina, get the fuck out of here. Scared? Little baby scared? Nah, yeah, I just don't want to be like inconvenienced even slightly ever is the problem mainly. You know what would probably help me? If I went to the fucking... If I went to uh, the round table hold and saw if I could upgrade my punch gloves. <laughs> Wait, why the twin maidens got new stuff? That ain't how this works. 
Wait, they have new things? Huh? So basically scared. Yeah, I'm scared. Yeah. Oh! They just... <laughs> you guys just sell that now? I mean, pretty neat. The rest of your uh, selection is beans. I'm gonna be honest. I don't know how the hell you stay open for business like this. The selection you have is, well, it's fucking cringe. I would have to use all of my gift cards and I still wouldn't have enough to get the flask, so. Yeah, no, I have the tier. I don't have the money to open to get a uh, flask though because I didn't even know it was on sale. Hello. It's a pleasure to meet you. My name is Roderica. I'm a recent arrival. Isn't this place impressive? Yeah. I live. I never knew Skip. Why. I'm still looking. It's all a bit. I'm still looking. Skip. He looks uglier. That might be the meanest thing I've ever heard anyone say. Well, I took you no matter. It's all out. He looks are. uglier now. So, uh, what's her? You're gonna tell me star fists or a smithing stone upgrade? Hang on one second. I need to use a gift card. I need to use my gift cards one second. Okay. I, I would like to upgrade my star fist. Oh, I'm gonna need more smithing stones. Alas, we gonna need more smithing stones. I don't know if the shopkeep sells them. So they sell level twos. The bell bearing shop might sell some. No. Fuck, dude! We got owned! We got owned and we got owned hard out there, chat. I feel like, hang on, did what's his face, you know, what's his face, did, I feel like he might have sold it. It's worth checking. You, everyone knows these gloves need to be stronger, so like, we might as well get to it. No, this guy just sold death root. Well, worth checking. Maybe Santa Claus. I remember there is that guy in the basement. Let me check Santa. <laughs> Santa copium. It's not copium. He's gonna have some. Wait, well, you're back. Oh my God, you look so dumb. I mean, we don't have enough to do actually anything with that, but. You do look really dumb. Also, I'm just gonna take his bell bearing so I never have to come back down here again. Cool. Thanks. You've just lost your job. Goodbye. And with this, your business is ruined. Goodbye. Where was I before I was... Where the fuck was I? I was in Lando. Was that the capital? All right. First things first, summon the help. I am not above it. And I think it's funny, which is why I'm going to do it again. That's right. Yeah, if only I could jump the fence. 
Who even is it over there? Wait a minute, is that fucking- is that goddamn Godric? Who is that? There's like a dude with an axe. Is that just actually just Godric? What the fuck is that? No, Godric has like good armor on. Oh no, that's what's his name. That's not Godric. Wait, no, it's it's that it's the grafted guy. It's the one. It's the it's God. It's God. Godfrey. It's Jeff. It's Jeffrey. It's yeah. We got Jeffrey over there. He's at the Elden Throne, or whatever. It's Jeffrey. Oh, this guy doesn't respond. Okay. Yeah, sorry guys. That's not Godric. That's Jeffrey. He's totally different. Do we just jump down there? Fuck it, I'm fighting him. Melina, with me! Let's do this! Okay, you jump down. Oh, fuck. Dude, that wasn't words, man. You missed. He's got his blood moves! It's the real one! First Elden Lord! death I've had that's of any real consequence has actually just been me jumping off of cliffs, falling into holes, slipping off railings, thinking that behind me is like a fucking floor, but it's just another goddamn hole. If tomato doesn't have the shackle, it's gonna get real bad. Oh yeah? You haven't seen me spam R2 this uh, at, during this fight yet. But, chat. You guys haven't seen me try that move on him from on the railing. And you definitely haven't seen me do this move on him from the railing. And, I mean, if neither of those work, you definitely haven't seen me try this one at point blank. For about 17,000 darts of like 200 damage each. You've not seen any of those, so how could you possibly know? I'm gonna try to cheat. Here I go. Now, the dart move might just work right over the railing. We really don't know yet. Hang on. Damn it, I'm hitting it. Fuck, I keep hitting it. Okay, check this one out. Don't fall. It's super important we cheat. Ah, fuck, I fell. No! Dodged it. That didn't do much damage. Okay, Melina, do your thing and hold aggro while I cheese him. Ow. Melina, do something. He's... He's trying to kill me. Owie. Wait, is he about to heal? He should probably be healing any second now. Oh fuck. Ow! 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 Damn, he healed. A lot. Whoa, man! Relax! Melina! Take him down! Wait, hang on. I'm gonna go, you just keep fighting. Yeah, fuck that, she's on. Is this just a dead end wall? Fuck, I'm they're gonna make me go back there. God damn it. Fuck. I look like an idiot. This is just a hole. Fuck. Alright, God. Oh, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Fuck. Door's locked. All right, God. All right, I'm going back. Gosh, oh, she's going to be so mad. She's going to know that I, like, bailed out.
You must be crazy if you think you're gonna catch me like this. Vroom vroom, I'm out of here. Grail's Dragon Barrow. Cool, I'm in a cave. Been some time since I've been in a cave. Now, which cave, pray tell, is this one? It's a little fucking dark. There's like a sad gargoyle. Cool. Oh, smithing stone one, we needed those. Those were deeply desired by me. Wow, it's fucking dark. <laughs> what is this advanced darkness? I need a light source. It's okay, chat. We're gonna be able to see in a second. <laughs> this thing has been reworked from cool weapon I used to fight the forces of evil into a flashlight we used to see in front of us while we walk. Oh, all right. That's enough of that. What is this place? It's a place of peace and harmony. Salufus' so potion. I don't think I really need that. I just don't really think I want that. I, as a matter of fact, I don't want that. That's not something, that's something that you give that to someone and it just kills, it basically ruins their life, right? That's good. Hey chat, were there always just like normal creatures in here? Or are these people that would be dropping things if I took their lives? Cause like, I don't want to fucking do that. But if there's a chance one of them has something, it's just normal. Okay. All right, because otherwise, I was gonna fucking kill that thing. So this place was a, what the, who the fuck did I, I just killed like 30 things. This is, this is that cave where that bear's supposed to be, isn't it? So it's just a dead end. This is a true dead end zone? Wait a, hold up, whoa there, whoa there, what the fuck is going on down here? What the fuck is this for? Try to hide this from me, you little frog? I'm going in. It's a shame this had to be this way. Beer back. It's a it's a shame it had to be this way. Face me in martial arts combat. Now. On guard! Ha! Cha! Ha! Ha! Ground slam! Ow! Ground slam! Ow! Okay, stop. Ground slam! Boo! Now your turn. Ow! Fuck! Whoa! You're strong, but not strong enough. Uh. Ah! Uh. What just fucking throw at me, you freak? Don't 
try it! me hey don't you fucking heal you do that again all right there's a vast difference between you and I I'm allowed to do that I'm the player you do that again I'm gonna pull out the fucking earth bending gloves I swear to God I swear to God I will pull out the gauntlets we are not the same I'm doing this out of respect Wait a minute, I think I can just spam this. Oh, wait a minute, hang on. Sorry, man, I didn't realize until now I could bully you. <laughs> Thanks for the golden seed, idiot. We do love those. No honor? Dude, I battled him with my bare fucking hands. He could have done that too. He drank in the fight. So did I. Hello. How the fuck did that guy live? There's guys that- Ow, I'm getting bit by something! Something's fucking biting me! I can't see it. I can't see it, but something just bit me. George, something bit me really bad. I can't see. I can't see. Ow! What the? There's another fog gate down here. I needed to equip my nightlight and I couldn't fucking see. Wait, I don't use my offhand. Like, I literally don't. Why do I not simply put it here? Oh, it's still gonna use that first. Damn. Well, if I do this, then I can see. There we go, that's still easier. All right, well, uh, which way is it? That's the weird light. Uh, I went this way. I don't know who that freak was that I- what? How did I- Man, this place is a fucking maze, man. Get out of my fucking way. Oh, there we go. Oh no! <laughs> My runes! All 5k of them, how will I ever get those back? How the hell am I ever gonna recover from this one? Damn, where else is Tomato gonna get out of this one? Oh shit. I don't get fooled by the same thing twice. And I know where I'm going now. So whoever's in the darkness there, well they can stay in the darkness for all I care. I'm running to the goal! <laughs> oh, it's darker here. I think if you squint carefully, you can almost see Rykard in there. I need my nightlight. Wait, 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 wait. 
other way around. Wait, wait. Oh, no, wait, no. We're just at Seeds Water Cave. All right, we're good. Fucking see. Dude, that's like a horror movie creature. What the fuck? I'm running. I'm gonna follow the dim lights of these plants and run for. Oh, fuck. I live. A lot of poison down here. Huh? What? Oh, a ring. This is nasty, man. I want to find the way out of here and never come back. At least I can see. I don't even want to fight these guys. I just want to get out. What am I doing? Excuse me. Ha way past cool. Yeah. Let's surf. What the fuck are you? There's a bird in the room. Oh, fell. I gotta go down there, man. Run. It can't fit. Run. Dude, I don't know what you are. Dude, I don't know who you are. You gotta move. It's, I'm in the shadows, man. I don't know what the fuck is happening. I think there's a bird ahead of me still. There's totally a bird in the room. There's a bird in the room. I can't fucking see me. There's a bird back there, man. I'm telling you. Just hit the fucking door and hope that it's not a boss. Because if it is, we have no way to get through this without getting poisoned. Where the fuck are we? We're in another catacombs. It just gets worse and worse, deeper into the abyss. See, here's the thing. Chat. We have another option. We can also go back to Landell, to the capital. There's one other fog gate in Landell. We can do that too. Let me just check. So, uh, I think if we press, we were at the war dead catacombs. Just, just remember that. So in case we get like, we decide we don't want to do that. We don't forget which catacombs we were at. Yeah, I don't know if, uh, going in from the outside would change where the fog gate takes me. Actually, I think going out there to do that would soft lock. And I also want to get that item from that thing. That little bin. There's a couple items I want to get. I might also be able to access all of Leyendel despite the situation, if that makes sense. I might actually be able to access the whole capital. Let me try. Yep. I can access all of Leyendel without actually like having a spot for it. So that's good. Yeah, we can do whatever we want. Okay. We have Leyendale. I repeat. And this is the last fog gate. We're gonna check this first. What's up, everyone? Hey, glad I finally made it to the party. All my friends are here. Champions, welcome. The stars have aligned. The festival. Ah, if it isn't a tarnished warrior. I cut him off. I am the warrior. Why is he so quiet? You know for whom this festival is being held? Well, it is none other than General Radan. The Epic. Sure to get I. We're friends. Alright, well, 
Uh, let's see where this takes me. This is kind of like a fucking intermission zone. There's no sight of grace here, so it's just kind of a- it's just a literal intermission. Where, pray tell, will you take me now? A fucking cave. Sage's cave, to be exact. Been on a real cave streak lately of caves I can't fucking see in. Uh... I think there's an invisible wall in front of me. Oh, okay. Flower. I can't, uh, because of the particle effect, I can't really see which spot here is safe for me to jump down, so I'm just gonna go like this. Okay, go fuck yourself, from soft. All right, that ain't the that ain't the randomizer. That ain't the randomizer. All right, that's just I could I thought that the ground was like maybe like twenty feet down. What? You want me to fucking jump? What am I kidding? Of course he didn't. You wanted me to take another invisible wall. Bro, look at this loot, though! That's a jar. Oh, <gasps> Gordon! What the? Oh, I remember that guy. Yeah, there's a fucking, there's a note about him in here. Yeah, I, I remember that guy. Yeah, we know him. I don't- well, you didn't get the remembrance, so that makes sense. Yo. Yo. Man. Yo, man. Man, what the fuck, man? That's a good one. That's a good one. That's a good one. Why are there so many of you in there? Why are there so many? A worthy challenge! Oh, there's a lot of you in there. Someone with an arrow is doing all of the damage for this team. In there. Like, it's not this guy. There's one dude with a bow and arrow that's hitting me for most of my HP. I can see it. I don't know what else is in the room here. I'm just kind of winging it now. I think I killed him. Yep. It got easier to see. Dude, there's so much loot in here. This is like a fucking gold mine. This is like an actual gold mine zone. Frozen needle. What else we got? A hundred dollar gift card. Someone's old tooth and a uh, foot. Duelist greaves. I mean, those are. I love pants. And those are just better pants than my pants. Do those reveal my toes? Ah, oh, hell yeah. Those. Te I can barely see it, but it looks like those are going to be revealing our toes, chat. Uh, yep. Yep. <laughs> Nasty burnt feet. What can you do, though? You know? Yeah. Can't fucking see. <laughs> Somewhere in this darkness is a creature that wants to hurt me. I can tell. Just two normal guys. Hello. I was wrong. I was wrong. That guy's not normal. I kill him. That dude, like, spawned some kind of fucking thing. So I learned a thing about my, uh, slam attack. Check. It isn't actually a circle around me. It's a cone in front of me. Uh, which is why that guy lived. I was trying to switch targets so once I killed him, I would already be on the next guy. 
Uh, he lived because it doesn't shoot behind me. So that's cool, now I know. Back through the shadows. Hopefully we don't aggro the fucking pit with 13 guys in there. I don't really want that. Stop. Just don't. Stop. And what even is this guy? He's like some scary bone guy, I don't... And now, to collect the reward. Root Goo. And now, to travel back into the shadows. Dude, I mean, the amount of treasure I'm getting is fucking premium. It is great. Ain't gonna complain. Got some raptor talons. I got uh, some starlight shards, the most useless item in the entire video game. Uh, fog, that's not fog wall, that's a waterfall, but relatively adjacent in concept. Invisible wall, revealing yet another two more wonderful chests, and let's not be fooled because there's actually another wall behind that wall which reveals a fog wall. But it's just a fucking devs never gave- this is like where they put every item they didn't know where to put in a different part of the game. I remember that guy! Yeah! <laughs> I do, though. I really- I swear I do. Yeah, I do. I do. I do. You ran past? Yeah! I did. Man, it's dark. So there's two fog doors. We'll check this one first. Dude, imagine not being able to beat this. I mean, of the options, that's really not a bad one. Be right back. That's really not a bad one. Like, I... Compared to, like... Chat, it could be, like three real bosses, you know? Could be worse. Man, I need to get a torch. Holy heck. That's honestly the best item I could find in the randomizer is a torch. So what's in this one? Can you see it all? Cause I can't. Whoa, whoa, wee, whoa, what the heck in the heck happened to my wizard sanctum? Why is there a giant dragon in it? Yeah, that's not gonna do. I'm gonna have to kick this thing's ass. Hey. Last warning to fly away before I show you what you're up against. All right. I don't know what happened. My guy kind of stretched out for a second there. I don't know what's going- you No, know, I bet I could get this guy to kill himself if I went over to this section over here. Hang on, I'll be right back. One second, man. Let me just get behind this. Okay. You come over here at your leisure. Yep, just a bit closer now into the clipping. Yep. Yep. Now fly up and awkwardly slam into that wall, clipping through it ideally if you'd be so kind. We're gonna have to employ real earth bending for this one, Chet. We're gonna have to employ real earth bending. I mean, we can kill him with bleed. It is possible. But holy heck. I can barely see what's happening. Ow. Get 
ready! <laughs> I hit the floor so hard I died. I, I jumped up and my ankles gave out and I hit the ground and my legs shattered. Oh, he's starting angry now. Looks less ideal. Surf move! Let's see how you do when your feet are all burned up. Oh yeah, you can fly. This guy has no idea how fucked he is. He knows I know Earthbending. I will defeat him with the power of Earthbending, and that's just about it. Ow, fuck. I do not like his lightning move. I don't like it. This guy sucks at one-liners. That's not... It's not fair. Rock move, rock move. Here comes another one. What the what just happened? Oh, what did he do to my oh? Yeah, that guy's got- I forgot how much this dragon has, like, every effect in the entire video game. <laughs> like, this is just a- this dragon does every move. This is like the- This is like the 12-year-old made up a character, like a super god character dragon. Like, they just know everything. <laughs> My best bet is to hide. Oh, fuck. Wait, what happens if I go out this door now from this side? Is that how these fog gates work? Or are these gonna take- is this gonna take me to a different zone now? This is back to Sage's cave. Hold on, let me try the other side. We've still got the other side. Chat, look, here's the thing. These kinds of characters, like Fortisax, they are not necessary to kill. Not all of them. So it's like, I'm not super hell-bent. I'm fighting them until I'm red, you know? So I kind of want to see, like, what my options are around. Oh, cool, a catacombs. Now that's way better. Am I on the wrong side of it? Huh. That's never happened before. Remember me? Well, that still does damage. Hang on. I wonder if this is a good amount of damage. The jump slam? Not really. See, my issue with this weapon is that, like, the air- the- the bending move is just about the only one that reaches up to him because he's one of the tall enemies. I don't like aiming at their legs because it's so little damage. Can't reach him. I need a better weapon for, like, tall enemies. I need a taller weapon for these, for the big boys. Rip runes? Yeah, I've been deeply concerned about those all stream. I'm glad someone noticed. Uh, am I strong enough to hold that? No. 
Ow, stop. Of course, the curved hammer. Dude, can't you tell that I'm not involved in the fight yet? Now I need, now here I go. I'm wrong. Uh, all right, dude. Like, honestly, in a way, if it wasn't for the bleed on the gloves, this is an easier way to fight this guy because he's moving around so much and there's not an easy lock on. All right, so anyways, I'm going to go back here. Wait, which one of these was the way I came in? Excuse me, man. I want to fight the three guys. I want to see how the three guys does. I think that's kind of what I'm realizing with the Starfist. They're not very good at fighting huge enemies, unless the huge enemy has a very obvious ground hitbox that doesn't move around a ton. Because for how mobile the, the character's weapon and like body is while I'm doing the attacks, it's really hard to aim at anything that's like wiggling around a lot with these weapons, a really short range. Either way, I'm still like going to die instantly this time because I have to. Because you see, here's the thing. I stagger instantly these guys. So like, see what I mean? Like I can very easily chew one of them up into like fucking goo in about one combo. So I think I hard counter the two crystal. Easily? Did you not just see what happened? You're gonna quote me on easily when you watched me bring that guy to sub half in one move? I'm not saying I'm gonna beat all of them in one thing, but I am very effectively killing one of their fucking staggers. I just have to get him separated for a minute. Still not easy with the other guy there. I think my best bet, because these guys don't all attack at the same time. They have like a minute where they don't react. I think I just got to run one so fast and then do the earth bending range thing instead. Yeah, why don't I try the one hander? Dude, the lock on. The lock on. That wasn't my guy. Is it worth aiming for the fucking frisbee boy? He's the annoying one. The other two just kind of walk towards you slowly. Nah, I need like a ranged thing. I need a ranged thing and to fight these guys, unless I got lucky and killed the two Crystallians, I'd have to get something to burn my uh my blight and my blood, uh, my poison. Try it one more time. Though. Try it one more time because I feel like I owe it to myself to see if I can do this. How much does that do for me? Does that stagger any of them somehow? Nah, if I just had more HP. Honestly, if I just had more HP and a little more poise to tank through it, I could just spin kill those two. They regen faster than the burn. I'm not trying to burn them. I'm trying to stack about 500 hits into them in one second and see if I just immediately break their stamina and stagger them. That's what I'm trying to do. That's what I'm trying to do. Thing is, I don't know if I could beat this guy on his own because I fucking suck at fighting these guys. And they just spam that move. Dude.
don't think I can beat him. I, I'm really bad, this guy. Dude, you know what I really fucking need? I need the upgrade to my flask so bad. I don't- I don't have- I keep getting flask charges. I haven't gotten anything to increase the amount I heal at all. If I- I didn't want to jump attack. I didn't want to do the fucking charge attack. I just wanted to do a normal punch because it would have stunned him. It would have staggered him right there. I would have had him if I- if I didn't do the jump attack. I didn't think I had started sprinting. I just wanted to close it. Yeah, so I can kill one of those guys in one cycle of a combo. Glad they're polite enough to wait. Thanks for waiting. Thanks for waiting for me, buddy. I'm also glad I picked a character that's short enough to fucking instantly kill that guy by ducking under his move. Don't want to do run attacks. I just want to poise right through it and punch him until he's staggered. As long as he doesn't put any statuses on me. Easy now. That didn't even do damage. That's a point down. And by point down, I mean point forward. And then a point down. I mean, the weapon's OP. <laughs> no one's gonna argue the weapon's OP. Uh, cool enemy, though. I really like that enemy. The crystal guys can go to hell. They're a gimmick, but... Crist uh, the fucking rot knights are fine. Even though I'm really- I feel like I'm bad at them. But that one just didn't really have a chance to fight me, because I was stunning him. Yeah, you see, this weapon's really good against, uh, single enemies. If I can 1v- if I can get in their face and they're shorter, like, they're not that tall, I think I can absolutely body anyone, but, like, that dragon's too big, and it doesn't have- it, st it doesn't stagger from a hit. And that's, like, the only thing I've got. It's the only thing I have is the stagger. So I don't think- I'm gonna try to see if I can get down into the capital. I want to get up there. Also, I don't remember how to get that. I mean, I could also try Moog again. I don't think we were losing. I don't think that was a lost fight. I just didn't think we were winning that effectively. Let me up there. I don't remember how the fuck I get up there. I gotta go around. I, oh yeah, I could level up again. But will I? But do I want to do that? Or do I want to continue to wait until I lose all my souls when I get killed? You know, I did forget that I can get the flask. The physic flask. $5,000, dude! 
A gift card? See, why does that pit exist? It's the only reason I lost to that guy down there. Because I got hooked. One of these fucking gems, one of these tiers is probably really good and would make me very powerful. I just need to check. Wait a minute. Was there a third fuck? Was there like a fourth goddamn mist portal in the Moog room? I'd like to use my souls to buy the flask first. Thank you. Before we do anything ridiculous, let's just use the flask. We need to get the flask. Hello? Oh my god! Who the fuck are you? You fucked up! You fucked up! You're dead! You think I'm dead? You're gonna die here, Encha of the Royal Remains! Oh fuck, they killed me! Oh! It's condom, man. I got to keep all my souls. Classic, common. W for uh, me. Etcha! Come on out! This time I want to fight you for real! Jump up onto the table! Let's finish this! Get back up on the table, Etcha! Come on now! Oh! Oh, fuck! Dude, I want his weapons, man. Earthbender versus Firebender, man. That dude's got fucking fire gloves. They blew me up. He literally blew me the fuck up. Whatever, I got to keep my souls, man. I'm going back over there. <laughs> we can do this all day. Edge! You can't win every time. Cause this time I'm pre-casting. Slam! It does not very much damage. I... Dude, chat. I watched him shoot fireballs out of his hands that time. That guy's actually got the version of the fucking earth gloves. He's got the fire version. He literally has the fire version. There is a fire version, and he just used it on me again. That's it. Take me back up to the queen's bedchamber. I'm not an expert, but you might need to dodge. No, this is a this is a fucking like, look, dude. This is a bravery contest. Neither of us are gonna dodge. He's not dodging. All right, I'm not dodging. Neither of us are gonna fucking dodge, and I'm actually pissed that you'd even ask that. Or imply that I should. Your thoughts, uh, you need to knock it off. Your ambitions, the what I need is to do more damage. And have more faith. And have more health. Okay, those are the things I need. For this one. Thanks for understanding. Venture. How does fire beat rock? I know, it's something I, I just keep thinking about. <laughs> Here's the thing though, the magma is ripping him up. We need to place that. We need that placed and he's fucked next time. That magma, that was ripping him up. See, the problem is, it's such a small arena, it's just not right for me. Precast, quick. You can't just do that to me. Who are you? 
Encha, stop. Encha, you're, you're messing up the sacred bonfire. This dude actually just one shot me with a punch to my chest. That was a real one. Before it was like two hits, which was like, all right, fine. That one was a real one shot. It hit me so hard, I died. Instant. Could we play as them instead? Precast it. Stun lock him inside of it. Dude! <laughs> this dude! This dude's weapons are cracked! He's stronger than me! Why am I lo losing to the walking penis? Okay, so here's what I have to do. I just have to do everything perfect and not fuck up any part. I just wanted to buy my fucking flask, dude. I didn't even care about this. Get mad, buddy. Oh my god. Dude. He's poisoning through my hands! Dude, I just want to go back to the fucking round table, dude! So this is how all the other enemies in the game felt when I walked in with my funny gloves, huh? This is how all of them felt. When I walked in with the funny gloves. Let's try a different one. Dude, forget it. You can't even dodge him. He's casting stuff. Did he just galaxy brain pull me in so he could punch me? Why does he have a god build perfectly picked from a randomizer? He has a god build that he got from randomized seed. I have to try dodging. I didn't want to, but I have to. Dude, forget it, man. What do I- Alright, you know what's the problem? I have a bad habit in this game of rolling backwards. And his weapon fundamentally counters my move of roll backwards. Because it shoots every time he punches a fireball into my face. I have to roll. How is it copium for me? Chat. You're misusing copium. It's not copium for me to confront and accept a significant flaw in how I play the game. That's not copium. You're starting to misuse it again. You've forgotten how to use the emote again. He's stuck on stuff. No easy. Ensha, fuck off. Dude, my heals are so bad. I need the flask upgrades, dude. I have no healing. Yep, roll back again. Why do I roll? Why am I rolling back? But why am I doing that? It's wild because I'm pretty sure I have a, a plus two thing that gives me defense against fire damage on top of it. So imagine how much worse off I'd be if I didn't, you know? But where else can you go though? That's kind of the issue right now is that I'm stuck in an event. I need to go to the table to get the flask. So, 
<laughs> I have to kill him. The problem is my running move is really bad. And he two shot. I can't go back. Dude, I just can't go back here right now. He's hitting so hard and there's not enough space in here for me to like be able to dodge him. Like comfortably. And it's dark and I can't see. And I'm hungry. And I, I'm and my legs hurt. Remember how you beat the mimic tier? Well, yeah, but he's not showing up with uh He's not showing up with my kit. He's just showing up with the kit he was born with. He's just built different. Dude, it's just like... It's just there's no way. There's no way. Right now? There's no way. He's so aggressive. Like, I, the only way I get him is if I connect every hit. Maybe with the one-handed version. That or I need a different weapon. Did we disprove the magma strat? He has not given me time at any point to use the magma strat. Unless I literally do it like this and I kite him around and try not to get hit the whole time. But then sometimes my character just doesn't do the dash. I'm running. Yeah, it's like, dude, I can't do anything after the spin. Maybe the magma dash might work for a minute. Can't do anything after the spin. If the spin connects, I have to bail out of the combo because the follow-up move, he instantly breaks out of the stun and hits me. Stop rolling back. Yeah, no shit, buddy! Fuck you, dude! You know what? I've already said it. I know I subconsciously do it, but you know what? Your message won't make me stop. <laughs> your message, you're not going to be it, dude. You're not. I wish you were. I wish you were that strong, but you're not that strong. He waited out. The, he waited it out. Ensha, don't. It's just his normal combo that does so much damage. It's like, it's not even like I could have not rolled back there. I fought him in a hallway. <laughs> that guy was born with a god build. And when I beat him and I can buy my fucking flask, I'm going to feel pretty good. I wish I could fucking see. That would help if it wasn't absolute advanced darkness in here, you know? I'm just gonna keep doing this. Wish I could tell you why this was working. God, I wish I knew. Oh my god! <laughs> Dude, it's so fucking dark in here! I can't, I could, I literally couldn't see him until I saw the fire of his gloves in the darkness. I couldn't see him till then. Insert spam this move here. Yeah, you bet, dude. That's definitely gonna be what cuts it. Have you seen how much damage he does and how much poise he has? For sure, bro. I'll get right on. Yes. I like it when he does that for a second. Oh, 
by. What am I stuck on? A chair? Dude. That time he just didn't roll. If I didn't get stuck on a chair, I would have had him, I think. Just from like this cycle. But there's like a little bit of trash on the ground. I can get him. This technique works. This works. I just have to surf. It's also like, depends on if I get lucky on... Like, look at that. There's like this little bench there that I get stuck on. Okay. So what I do is I gotta keep a little wider. Every time I do it, I roll. No, 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 no! He's looping around the other side. I predicted it, I saw it. Dude! That thing is so bad. That thing is the- that is what- is something gonna kill me right now? It's gonna be that. That half. That fucking bench. That little stool. If I get him to a quarter health, I think the play is I fucking try to combo him. I saw it, dude. I predicted you that time. Dude, not catching me that easy. As your Ain't no fucking way! Dude. I can't fucking see him in the lighting of the map. I literally couldn't see what move he was doing. I don't know if you guys can see it better with the contrast difference, but I can't see in the lava. So if I see his name, I just know he's doing a move. I just know he's in there doing something to me. I get better at the surf strat every time. Okay. I came out of it. There he is. I'm healing. I don't have time to do that. I burned way too much when I was panicking. Dude, he just outpoises me. He literally just outpoises me. That time was a lit, just straight up has more poise. Like, I connected the hit first, and he just punched right through it. Like, I think this is the way to do it. It's just, there's a lot of RNG on whether or not he tries to use a spell at me. Because I think if he tries to, like, if he doesn't dual wield, sometimes he comes out and takes a staff out, see? If I get him stuck in that one, he's actually, like, easier to deal with. Dude, stay away from me. Okay, I was locked onto him. That was my fuck up. I locked onto him. I was trying to see if I could continue to freely rotate around the map while locked onto him. Because that would make it a lot easier. God, I really wish this wasn't a forced thing. But, like, I can't access the shop or do anything in the round table hold till this guy's dead.
maybe I just... No, he just... Dude, he's just... It's a mix of... It's a mix of him being really strong and me still working with tier one flasks. I think. Like, if I had a flask that fully healed me or healed me a little more when I drank it, I'd feel more confident being in melee with him. But if I have to heal, it's a full, like, three, four swigs to fill up. Staff's out. But the running attack is so bad. Dude, it's like, he's got the craziest chase. If I just had healing. Maybe I try to equip every fire armor I have, which isn't a lot. It's gonna feel bad when ironically I'm already wearing the best fire resistance stuff I have. I can put that on. This technically gives me more fire resistance. I am now technically as resistant to fire as I could be. Sometimes my character doesn't start the dash. Which is really bad. Okay, if I get him like stuck up on the table, he seems to take a lot more. Okay. Okay. Yes, man! Do a jumping attack. Over the ta over the whole table. Didn't die instant. That is true. I didn't die. Normally, I think that was an instant death. I'm technically stronger. Problem is, a lot of my kit works against me in this fight. Like I don't, I have, I don't want to be dashing because all of these moves that suspend me, like any jump move, it's not going to stagger him. So it's mostly just going to get me killed because he's going to get a free hit on me. I really have to, like, wait for him more. I think. I had to wait for him to close the gap. And I gotta hope he doesn't do a jump. The fucking stool, dude. No way. It's getting darker in the fucking room. Great enemy felled. Oh, 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 well, as long as you say it was a great enemy. I'd agree. No, give me his weapon. Fucking hell, I just, oh, maybe, possible. Fuck you, fuck you. Dude, I just wanted to use a gift card to buy a fucking flask. That's all. That's all I wanted to do here. It's not like I was coming over to like, do something crazy. I just wanted to use a gift card to buy my flask. You know? That's what this was all about.
I didn't want any trouble. What the fuck was that about? That dude's psycho. I... Yeah, uh... Yup. Not bad. Let's go back to lane, Del. Dude, that was fucked. The fact that I had to actually use my cheese weapons I thought were so ridiculously OP in order to win that and had to use the cheesiest fucking option to do it is unbelievable. <laughs> Good thing that guy's dead forever. I'm not gonna fight Moog yet. I want to see if I can do the other uh, tree root freak. And then I might check out Leyendel proper. At least it was memorable. Yeah, I mean, I hated him. I hated it. Hello. Surf's up! Now that's the damage I like to see! Vroom vroom, motherfucker, let's dance! Skrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
Although that only takes away most FP use now. So I can't just infinitely surf. Well, we got him. Yeah, but what did you drop for me? What did they drop? Chip. Nothing? No. Not even a fucking gift card for my troubles. Not even the gift card for my fucking trouble. Satisfaction in a job well done? No sad. No one's ever been satisfied fighting a tree spirit boss in Elden Ring. Not one. All right, Chad. I'm in the wilds of Landell now. I'm not supposed to be here, so don't tell anyone. It's a I'm actually not supposed to be in this part of the map. I jumped out of the zone. I've circumvented the walls of this world. What in the hell is that sound? Good thing that's down there and I'm up here. Or I'd be pretty freaked out. Hello. Stop. Stop, you nasty frog. This was always one of those corners of the map that I was like, there's got to be more to it than this. And it was like, only the statue thing is like the only reason this place exists. It's like so weird, this spot. It's like the same feeling I get from that Bloodborne hall that like has like the door that's locked and doesn't open. Something odd is happening here. You tell me that thing dodged this? Yeah, you can actually live this fall. All right, chat. We are in the capital. There's just people hanging out. It's actually pretty chill. Dude, what just happened to me? I fucked around and I got owned. I don't know what to say. I fucked around and that guy's like fucking squad of goons turned around and broke my neck. <laughs> that was the, that was the angriest two characters I've ever fought. I'm going back down there. What well, is a good item down there, though? You know, I haven't checked. What if there's an epic item down here? I don't fucking think there is. I don't remember there being one. I actually don't think this links to the root over there, which means I'm forced to go into. Oh, wait, there is one item. Hang on. Wow, garbage. Wow, trash. Nice. Now what? I literally have to go through the fog gate. Cool. You found the Beyblade? Yeah, but my magical gloves let me surf. 
What if this up here is a different fog gate than all? Oh. All right, mug. What the? <laughs> Wait, are you telling me going in for? Oh, that does make sense. Oh fuck, I forgot that fog gates have different sides. Those are different sides. Well, I'm in a. Huh? Kind of forgot. Uh, the, the math of all this is, it's all very confusing. You see. Well, here we are. In like the stinky zone. It's the stinkier part of town. People don't come here anymore. I, you see, this feels like that place you should be able to summon torrent. It's a little big. I don't like walking. Like, look at how far away that thing is. It'd be so cool if I could have summoned my horse and just ride. Oh, loot. A $40 gift card, I'll take it. He loves riding horses. If I could replace it with a motorcycle, I would, just to be clear. Like if it could just be like a, like a Legend of Zelda, Breath of the Wild style, like motorcycle. Yeah. In, a, in an instant. If I had infinite surfing speed, I'd do that too. That also works, but surfing's not infinite. I should actually check right now. We're in the perfect setting. It's pretty good. Hello. Get ready to die. Yeah, that guy kind of owned me. <laughs> nice aim, idiot. Let me show you how it's really done. I said, let me show you how it's really done. Hits him four times with rocks right to the dick. Depth perception sucks. Dude, is this guy gonna fall over? Like, what is this guy's stat? Like, how's he got this much stamina? I thought it- Oh, there it goes. <laughs> like, I'm pretty sure he's supposed to, like, get one shot by me at some point. What? 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 Huh? Oh. Alright. We got there. Huh? Okay. Yeah, I wonder if we'll find Bach anytime soon, chat. Let's give what let's get let's uh let's get a round of applause for Bach, everyone's favorite fucking character. I think we're gonna run into Bach soon. In the open world. Yeah, we love Bach here. We're all big fans of Bach. Does this door open? No. Is this just like that? I can't remember. Is this like just a dead end shithole zone? Well, who lit the tree on fire? I didn't do that. It, oh, this is post the whole place on fire. That's why this was Asher. I should have fucking known. I forgot this is like after it all got real bad. So there's actually nothing. This is actually just a dead end. I think. Unless there's like a hole. Is there like a fucking hatch into some like fucking s like sewer over there or something? 
Looks like there is something. I should go check that. Yeah, I'm not... Uh, chat, you say there's a tree spirit fight. I remember that. I do. I, though I, I don't think it's going to be a tree spirit. I'd see them on the ground. I'd see whoever I was going to fight, like, just walking around. I think. That's just a dog. That's just a dog. I don't think there's anything here. I think I'm just going to warp back to Leyendil. The original Leyendil. Huh. Yeah, this is just sand, man. Chat, it's just sand. Huh. What a fucking messed up place. I mean, I feel like now I got checked going into Moog's arena from the... Wait. Which one did I try? I went into his arena from the outside of the jump I did, which lets me go to the rest of Leyendel, right? Did I try it from the inside going out that way? I can't remember which one I did. Did I do both already? I don't think you did the inside. I don't think I did either. And I also didn't go into the fourth one, the small one. There's like two more gates in Moog's chamber that I didn't do. Wow, there's a lot of loading happening. got to unload all the sand you know they actually uh all that sand was simulated and rendered individually so there's a lot of sand they got to uh they got to reload i think i'm gonna alt f4 and restart it i think uh try to think i think uh, elden ring died i think elden ring died i'm gonna relaunch it I think, I think they killed Elden Ring. Elden Ring is dead. And now the game won't launch because it's still fucking, dude. Steam needs to, Steam needs to accept the reality that when I close a game with Alt F4, it should immediately fucking recognize it's closed on Steam. Check the fucking executable. Don't waste my time having to go into Steam to tell you to turn it off again. It's not like I have cloud saving. What are you kidding me? What are you crazy? Now load the game. Well, that just ain't right. Unload the sand. Now. It's time. I'm trying to figure out if it's like faster to do that or just walk. Okay, I'm gonna try going down into Moogs and go in the far way. Don't mind me. Ow! I definitely didn't go out this way, dude. I went out the far, the other side. Dude, there's three? Oh my god. <laughs> Let's check them all out, dude. Not interesting. I will literally never go in that gate again. Come on, me, Mo. Yeah, pass. Is there, unless there's another door in there and I can walk right by him. What the? Wait, how the heck did. What? How does that math add up? What the hell's happening? How did I get here? I was. I could have sworn I went out the other door. Now, the question is, chat, is this 
the same fog gate as this. <laughs> How deep does this rabbit hole go? Ain't no way. Ain't no way. T send me back. Ain't no way. No. So where the heck does this one take me? That means I have three more to check inside Mugs Arena too. <laughs> huh. Some shitty catacomb, don't really care. I'm leaving. Dude, Mug's room is cracked. Mug's room is fucking cracked. Huh, well, it's good to know I have like five things I need to check with Moog. I feel like before I check this side again, I need to like start at the beginning of the thread, you know? But then again, what if that just leads right to like, chat, we could just find the way right into the fucking we could beat this game if we get lucky. Just like that. Get out of my way, old man. There's no items here, but I can climb that and go upstairs. Well, actually, no, because that's not a fog door. This part isn't a fog door. So I can't actually take this way at all. I'd like to go back this way. Back to Moog. Hey, Moog. Hi. <laughs> Stop stalling and fight Moog. I don't want to. I'm not going to get fooled by that twice. Doggy. Cookbook. Grease. I think I'm locked in here. Oh yeah, I'm locked in. Ow! Grease, it's just grease in here. All right, this room sucks. <gasps> Get me out of here! Ow! Okay, man. Just give me a second and I'll be out of your hair. Left first! Go, go, go! What the hell is that thing? There's like some kind of weird slug over there. Gonna be walking for a while, man. Or you get tired? Pathetic. You know, that really makes me pretty sad. It's been a while since I've been this sad. Damn. I need a drink. Alright, I'm gonna go back there and I'm gonna kill him, I think. Because that guy. I, I feel like I clock this guy. I feel like I can own this guy. All right, fucko. Get ready for some ranged air bending moves. Wait, wait! Oh! Away. Oh, My armpit does damage! My Grundle does damage! <laughs> it's just... Oh, hang on. You guys think I get... How far do you think the range is on this move? It's not bad. 
dude. <laughs> what kind of fucking bullshit was that? What kind of moves you doing, bro? And again, I, it's not like I'm not doing some funny moves, too. We're all being a little funny. Activate cheese build. Okay, the second move's a trick. Unless I'm fighting big packs. Dude, I love that I have to aim at his fucking weird head and I can't see any enemies in Elden Ring. Whenever anyone says Elden Ring is a perfect game, I have to point at the uh, scale of the enemies versus what the lock-on gives you and why it doesn't pull your camera back farther. Like this mod tries by pulling it back and it's still not enough. It's still never enough. It's never enough. That was just me not rolling. <laughs> that, that wasn't the game's fault. That was me just, for some reason, choosing not to dodge that attack. Damn, that move has such a long build up. I gotta find a different option. Get out of the lobby. Keep hucking rocks at that guy's head. Drink juice. Where is it? I, I should be dead. I lost lock on, but I live. How you feeling, idiot? Oh. Turn off the lock on now. <laughs> Yeah. Damn, man. I'm getting owned. Feels like it's just about time to sit. Feels like it's just about time to surf out of here. Cool, man. My guy ran into it. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Which is your lava? It was the lava that I uh, got. Uh, I didn't get hit by. That was mine. Just letting them know I care before I kick their ass. Just letting them know I give a fuck before I kick their ass. Bleed just not working them. It doesn't really click well with their torso. You have to hit him in the head to do a lot of bleed. Damn, good damage on that move, man. That was a really cool move. Just gotta remember which lava is my lava. I can't tell which lava is my lava. There's a lot of lava on the screen, folks. Hard to tell right now. Is he good? I think that's 
gonna be it. Yep. We got him. And I got a new open world site of grace are available. Oh, that was a that was a key character or enemy then. Because that means now I have access to hang on, what's the above ground? God knows which one it's which one it is. It didn't uh, tell me. So now I can just go. Wait, so if I have access to that, does that mean I also have access to all the exterior fog gates in the open world now as well? So like if there's one out here that leads into a cave, I can use that one as well. Which means my like pool for options to search for places has just gone up massively, technically. I know there's a cave right over here. I'm just gonna go check. Let me just go ahead and peek. Dude, that's like that's like so open that I don't know how we'd ever find the actual exit to the game. Like the final zone. That's so many places. Is that the cave? Yeah. Let me off! Torment! Okay, no, 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 okay, that makes sense. Yeah, so you can't go into... The open world is just to explore the open world. You can't actually access any of the dungeon part of the game from the open world. And that's good. That's as it should be, to be honest. So, what you do out here is you look for, like, extra miscellaneous items, and, like, you can explore and do, like, quests and stuff. <laughs> the fucking glove. All right, chat. That's uh, I think that's gonna do it for tonight, though. I've been going for six hours. Kind of lost track of time on this one, but I had, I mean, I had a lot of fucking fun. I everyone knows I've got my issues with Elden Ring, but I do still quite love this game. It was a good time to play it in this weird fucking format. Uh, the whoa, hey guys, what the heck is going on in here? Just mind if I have that? Ooh. Ow! That guy just tried to kill me and my horse. What the frick? What did I even relocated to deep root depths? <laughs> did I just get an IOU with an address to where my item is? Oh yeah, we're done. Oh yeah, we're done on that. We're done on that for today. Oh yes. Hang on, there's one thing I need to do. I'll do it after stream. I gotta make sure I screenshot all the settings for this. Uh, for the uh, randomizers, just in case, who knows? I want to make sure I have them saved. But yeah, uh, thanks chat for hanging out. Thanks for the gifted subs and donations and bits. I do appreciate it. As always, I will be back tomorrow. Don't know what I'm doing yet, but I will be back tomorrow. So keep your eyes peeled. Thanks. You can save the options file in your settings with the uh, enemy item randomizer. Yeah, I probably should just do that. Export. Okay. Saved options. There we go. Cool. Awesome. All right, chat. I'll see you all tomorrow at the usual time. Thanks for coming on by. I will catch you later. Goodbye.